Mao. <laughs> Mao. Can you hear me? If you can hear me, say. Adelie face question mark. I will stare into your soul. With my poor Photoshop skills. <laughs> With my poor, um, yes, rigged edges. <laughs> oh, my mask. Oh, ayo. Hi, user, thank you. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. My name is Arudi Face. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> yes, I did that just for this. I I I removed the surrounding uh, other than a mask for this. Okay, but hello, welcome. My name is Aurigale Arudi, and I'm a wind up doll VTuber. Nice to meet you. Yeah, you can call me Arudi. Wait, wear it. <laughs> You want me to wear it? No, I can show you a close-up of how terrible it is. The Photoshop. <laughs> Do you see the rigged edges? <laughs> it's terrible. It's terrible. It looks absolutely horrible. But this is this is the best I could do. Photoshop skills. Look at it. Look at it. Look at the white edges. Suddenly there's a white border. <laughs> I will put it on. Ah! <laughs> it's pinned to my hair! <laughs> yes, yes, yes. <laughs> oh lord. <laughs> boing, boing. <clears throat> Alright. Okay. <laughs> Having too much fun, a little too early. I am happy to say that my second monitor's cable came in and my second monitor is is working. All right. Ah. And I'm using it right now. Hopefully everything goes well. I hope everything is is going well and that you know there's no problem with it or whatsoever. But yeah. <clears throat> Good morning! Good morning! Hello and good evening to a lot of you guys. Alright. Oh, just a Let me shrink my chat box a little bit so I can read. We will take attendance at the end of the stream instead of at the start of the stream today. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna unpin that. Hello, everyone! Yeah. Before we start, I just want to say that I have some syrup limau ice, which is like a rose syrup lime juice question mark. And I will be drinking it throughout this hopefully productive stream. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty, ready. Um I don't I don't want to start so early. I mean, I didn't I didn't want to I didn't want to go off so early in the stream, but uh OE Afisk, let's have a talk. Okay? If you <laughs> if you read my posts, okay, about this today stream, you would read that stream I put it at 7 p.m., but I put a bracket and said that I would probably start an hour early or an hour later. Did you see that or did you not see that? I feel like you probably should start reading what I write. So then you won't be waking up at fucking 6 a.m. And then bitch if I don't start at 7 a.m. Just so I start at your 8 a.m. I'm so sorry, but like, I already put a disclaimer. Because if I didn't, it's my fault. But I did. So check yourself. Okay? Like seriously, don't come to people's chat sounding like a fucking 15 year old. And then expect to be like entertained. I, I can't. I'm too old for this shit. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to be nice to everybody. I'm trying to come here and have a good time. So like fucking at least learn to read before you ask anything. Yeah? Are we clear? We good? Yeah? 
Yes. All right. Perfect. Because if you can't behave in my chat, I would rather not have you around. I would rather never have any bad kids around and bad viewers around. I will not entertain to anybody because I'm not a fucking idol. I don't want to be an idol. I'm not here to tell you what you want to hear. I'm here to make a really healthy and happy community where everybody learns to goddamn read. And if you can't do that, bye. <laughs> I'd rather not have you around. I do not hesitate twice, okay, to cut people out. I will say that. I'm that kind of streamer. I'm sorry if you hate to hear that. I'm sorry that I look so pretty, but then I cut so damn much. But like, you just gotta deal with it. Okay? Okay? Do we all have... Are we all in an understanding? Yeah? Yeah? Alright, perfect. Perfect. I only like good kids. And I only want good kids in my chat. If you can't fucking behave, leave. <laughs> I'm the kind of streamer that would not hesitate to tell you you don't like me, don't watch me. Okay, I have a fucking day job. I don't rely on you to put a roof over my goddamn head. So I'm not here to like fucking entertain you and turn the whole universe and run around you, okay? I'm not like that. Alright. With that being said, never cross me ever again. <laughs> okay. They don't call me a fucking mama tiger for nothing, okay? <clears throat> yes, yes. You're all my babies. So be good. <laughs> I only like good kids. I may not be Santa, but... <laughs> and I may not bring you gifts. But you know, we. I will bring you a good and healthy community. <laughs> Hell yeah. Mama angry tiger, yeah. I mean, I mean, yeah. <laughs> I do have a cat, and I am the alpha of this cat, so I am the mama tiger. <laughs> Hell yeah. Alright. <clears throat> so, after all that, today, <laughs> we're going to be playing Sally Face. It is episode 2, but um, I don't know. I feel like you don't need to watch episode 1 to know what's going on. You could probably pick it up as you go. Um, I don't really know what I'm doing in this game anyway, so I don't think you're like missing out much. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, if you don't know who Sally Face is, you must be so confused <laughs> with the mask that I was wearing before. <laughs> Why is she wearing that? You know, people be like, what is that? What is that mask? What is this? Now, this is Sally Face's mask. What is she? Why is she called Sally Face? I don't know, but she's just called Sally Face. Um, yes, today, today we may or may not be Rudy Face. I don't even know what the story is about, but apparently we are ghost hunting um, in an apartment that we just moved in Okra. Yeah, is this horror again? Yes, Ledu. Okay, let me double check some settings. <clears throat> Alright. Did you guys watch the World Cup, by the way? <laughs> Did you guys watch World Cup? I, I delayed it because I knew a lot of people were watching World Cup. And they were watching it was Japan versus... Who's it again? Costa Rica? Costa Rica? Japan versus Costa Rica, I think. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It just ended. And I think some other team's gonna play, but I was like, I gotta stream, man. <laughs> I didn't really watch watch it because I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I don't know. Yes. <laughs> I don't really do sports, so I'm just like. Mm. Yeah. Thank you, Demong, for one dollar. Happy streaming. Thank you so much. Hmm. Give me one moment. I threw up. I'm resting. Oh no! Food poisoning, eh? I hope you feel better. The only sport I watch is esports. <laughs> the only sports I watch um, um, is me um, running my life in circles. What? <laughs> Sokana! No! <laughs> no. <laughs> he left no more of such jokes. <laughs> we will not get these nuts again. Just a highlight, oh bruh. It just ended, it just ended, I think. Yeah. Okay, let me move over here. 
My... <laughs> my second monitor is so big. <laughs> I... I have to really turn my head to see the far end. <laughs> Which is not what I'm used to. I, I need... I need to sit back a little bit. So then... Okay. Okay, this is better. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Um... Let me get the game up. Ah, Toto. Before we get the game up. Oh, it's you Close this. I'm gay. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gay. Uh. Alright. <clears throat> My dad has guests over, so if you guys hear him, don't mind it. Is this too loud? Ah, check, check, check. Is this too loud? Should be okay, right? Because their, their songs are like rock. <laughs> it's so loud. <laughs> I played badminton last night. Does that count? Yes. Yes, it, it does. Even if you play futsal like once every year, you're still doing sports. <laughs> Sounds good, yeah. Kato, hello! Yeah. Okay. We will continue where we left off, and honestly, it's a puzzle game, and... You guys know me and my struggle. <laughs> with, pu with puzzle games. What, what were we doing? <laughs> what were we doing again? I don't remember. What? Head banging, yeah, okay. I may or may not have forgotten the controls. <laughs> um, floof! I love how the graffiti says floof. So at least like this, I'm not blocking much. I hope. Hi Cornelius, hello! I have no memories of this place, me too! <laughs> Do we just like keep walking and walking and walking? Forgot where we stopped! <laughs> I forgot to! Oh my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you to Agar, thank you. Don't remember us being an old man. Yeah, what What do I press to interact again? E? Maybe we just like keep, maybe we just keep walking. Wait, what? Do you see the graffiti? It says free cell. Free cell, God is dead. Free cell. Free cell? Is it like Sally? What? I mean, we did go to jail. <laughs> We didn't go to jail. I thought there was a person behind me. Mm. Did you guys eat dinner, by the way? I had p uh, pineapple fried rice. What's going on? Oh no! People like drew on it and stuff. I had kebab. Ooh. Time to wash back the VOD. <laughs> Hell yeah. They're filled with clothes, books, cassettes, nothing of importance. Picture. Seems to be photograph of Larry's parents. Nothing strange about it, though. Shelves. Rusty tools and other various junk. Floor. And a few old amateur paintings, probably Larry's. Ugh, there's absolutely nothing up here. I don't know what I was thinking. Guess I needed to see for myself. Sal was so convincing, and this whole thing seemed has seemed... Off. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! What? Mommy, hello? I, I just got jump scared. Ghost of Larry? Larry fucking died? Larry died? Wait, what? Dr. Anon? Enon? What? What? Ah! Don't freak out, man. We need your help. You have to get Sal out of jail. This shit is much deeper than we thought. Please. We have to get Cell here. What? This, you're, you can't be. Calm down, dude. You're gonna give yourself a heart attack. This is important. If Cell doesn't get here soon, then... Then we are gonna die and we are gonna turn to a ghost. Shit. Oh! Holy crap, it is so freaking loud. I gotta turn this down for myself. Oh! We died! <laughs> no! Oh my gosh! What? Achievement unlocked. Conjure. Our doctor died. I'm so 
in shock. I'm so in shock. Is this real? Am I dreaming? White room ethne me. I'll find me in the room white white room. Don't forget what I told you. Find me in the room white. Wait, what? Wait, what? The doctor just died just like that. Others, others ought to play sif of caps not must. But you must not speak of this place to others. Am I supposed to figure out the puzzle? Do not. Do not what? Do not something e a l u r here. What's going on? <clears throat> you are safe here. Oh. Do not be afraid. You are safe here, Sal. But you must not speak of this place to others. Phantom. <clears throat> wait, what link do you want to post? Mercenary. Oh wait, not mercenary. Who asked this? Mechanic D. That now. The only one who believed you is dead now <gasps> what should i do rest r something 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 R rent <laughs> r something and something r, r something and something oh turn run Whoa, 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 Am I supposed to pull the lever? Huh? What does that do? What? Enter, there used to be a door here. Huh? <laughs> it's another VTuber doing a cover of a song. Oh, which VTuber is it? Is it true that you've forgotten to forego legal help in favor of representing yourself? Yes. I've got nothing to hide. Can you speak to your conviction of being an innocent man? Are you sticking with the story you've told the police? I will share the truth. Are you saying your original story wasn't true? I'll look at the name. Okay. <clears throat> I have no comment on that. Can you comment on this supposed person that allegedly killed your mother? <gasps> How do you explain no witnesses or evidence of any such person? Sally is a man? I believe so. I believe Sally is a male. <laughs> I just noticed... <laughs> I just noticed the words on the microphone says faux news and faux means fake. Yo, come check out my new channel. It's called Fake News. <laughs> Bro, what the hell? Fake News? <clears throat> right? You say faux fur, right? If you're wearing like a fake fur coat, like a, it's not made out of real animals. It's like, <laughs> it's like faux, F-A-U-X, right? <laughs> wow, so credible. <laughs> oh, Fox News. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Serafina channel? Serafina channel and the song's Golden Hour. Oh, is she the Anubis? She's so pretty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know who you're talking about. Um, we never talked or connected though. Yeah, I've only come across her on like Twitter or something. Yeah, thank you, Mechanic D. It's good to see you again. <clears throat> thank you, thank you. I don't see the relevance of that now. I hate his hair. Is it true that they're going to add the Sanderson murder to your charges? 
That would be news to me, but honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if they tried to pin that on me too. And what about Charlie Mansfield? I don't remember these names. <laughs> I have nothing to say about him right now, except I did what I thought was right at the time. Okay, since we aren't getting any major details from you, let me ask you our highest polled question. The viewers are very interested in this one. Is it true that you are granted special meal privileges because you because you're afraid of Bologna? Bye, thank you for coming. <clears throat> thank you. Hi, Tada. Shrimp question mark? Bologna? I'm not afraid of lunch meal, okay? I just... Well, it's a long story. Your trial is still a few hours away. I think we, we have plenty of time. Ugh. Alright. We're getting a flashback of why he's scared of the Bologna. The Bologna incident. <clears throat> okay. Mr. Dude L. What if I were more than just a doodle? Oh. Oh, I'd be in trouble because all of my <laughs> my quote-unquote drawings look like this. <laughs> Yo, that's a symbol we all do in our notebooks. Talk. Hello, are you okay? Okay. <clears throat> Good talk. What's wrong with your friend? He sought the truth and the truth destroyed his soul. That's so deep. Now please leave us alone. Your head will frighten the children. <clears throat> Can you tell me where your friend ventured to find enlightenment? He traveled to the wise prophet beyond the fields of death. Is this what children do in school nowadays? <laughs> you know what these pyramid heads remind me of? The little nightmare characters. <laughs> But a round head like you will never make it. How dare. How do I get down? Oh. Square head. Are you okay? What happened to your limbs? Well, I never. How would you feel if I asked you what happened to your weirdly shaped head? I didn't mean to offend. I was... Huh? <laughs> Go bother someone else. <laughs> okay. Getting a little, little edgy up in here. Hello? Are you the platypus? <laughs> I beg your pardon. <laughs> they have problems with round-headed people, guys. Let's riot. Let's cancel them. I'm gonna riot a twit longer after this. Hello, miss. Don't pay any mind to my sister. She's been cranky lately because of the sun. <gasps> if that ain't me, I don't know who that is. <laughs> the sun, ew, hiss. I'm just kidding. It's no problem. Our ancestors were mauled by the great beast? Ever since our people are drawn without limbs. What sort of beast could do that? We do not speak of such things. If you want to know more, you need to seek out the oracle beyond the death's field. Hi, Astro Harry. How you do? Oh my god. Are you the great beast? Well, fuck you too, friend. Why are they so mean? No, I'm sorry. Don't pay me any mind. My temper rises with the sun. <laughs> the great beast hasn't been seen for over 100 years. Do you know where the prophet is? I'm just thinking about a kid in school, bored as hell, writing like, who the fuck are you? <laughs> Yo. <clears throat> Do you know where the prophet is? You mean the crazy old hack who lives, lives beyond death? Just take that ladder down. It's always a ladder down. Okay. <laughs> the sun, you say. Thank you, Cherry, for satu minuman. Let's drink. <clears throat> oh, Lord. For real, for real? Is this the grandma? Hello? You shouldn't have come here. Where am I? A dark place. Is this a field of death? Horrible things happen when the sun burns out. Okay. Right? Oh! 
Are you the prophet? I'm called many names by the sticks. Do you know anything about the great beast? It crawled through the great hole many years ago. It ravaged the sticks for decades, then was laid to rest by a magnificent explosion in the sky. Most believe the beast to the dead, though, or to be dead. I was like, it doesn't make sense. Most believe the beast to be dead, though we know better than that. What is a great hole? <laughs> oh, would you like to find out? <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Hello, hello, welcome. <laughs> Eons ago, we created a great hole in the papery fabric of this world. A hole that contains all of the knowledge in the universe. How do I get there? What is the truth worth to you? I don't... There's... Everything. Okay... <clears throat> Damn that grandma voice spot on. Shut up! <laughs> shut, shut your mouth. Oh, we are reaching the hole. Child, what did you do to the paper? <laughs> His face. Oh. 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 Nani? Excuse me, Mr. Fisher. Sal, wake up. Huh? That doesn't look like math to me. Oh, sorry, I must have dozed off. I already finished the test. I know, dear. You acted it as well. Very good. Just try to stay awake for the remainder of class, okay? Sure, it won't happen again. <clears throat> what on earth? <laughs> and Mr. Phelps, eyes on your own paper. Huh? <laughs> Travis Phelps. Class is almost over. Make sure everyone's hands... Everyone hands in their tests before leaving. Okay. <clears throat> Can't sleep even though exam's finished. I know, right? That sucks. Like, usually when you're done with exams, you just crash. Hi, Ari. Felt sus. Here, here, here he is. Hey, freak. Nobody likes a goody two shoes, Sally face. Nobody likes a cliche bully, Travis. <clears throat> Don't you have something better to do? Shut up, bitch. I wasn't talking to you. Oh, no, you did. Hold my earrings. Hold, somebody hold my earrings. <laughs> you know, if you took that stick out of your own out of your ass, you may actually... <laughs> you, <laughs> you know, if you took that stick out of your ass, you may actually enjoy yourself for once. Maybe even make a friend or two. <laughs> Fuck off. I have more friends than you'll ever have. <laughs> this is such a childish conversation. You kiss your daddy with that tongue? I'm sure he- <laughs> Oh! What the hell, asshole? Are you right, Sal? I'm fine. Oh my gosh, this is not- not cool, kids. <clears throat> Come on, let's report that jerk. You know when you have- Okay, it's like this. When somebody- When somebody bitch talk you, and you- you talk smack back, right? The first person to- to show hands is the bitch. <laughs> Cause- only the, the real badasses can freaking clap back to the end. The, the, the person who has nothing left to say is the loser. <laughs> so the person who shows hands first are always like the fucking loser because they can't clap back no more. They, they punch or they smack or whatever. <clears throat> he punched a mask. I know, right? But he did bleed underneath a little bit. So that's that's a little alarming, yeah? Come on, let's repair the... Come on, let's report that jerk. I don't know why I give her the accent. Come on, let's report that jerk. Now don't worry about it. That just makes things worse. Trust me. I've dealt with bigger bullies than Travis before. <clears throat> Sally, you're bleeding. Oh shit. I'm okay, really. Here, let me let's use my banda bandan bandana. That's not how you spell bandana, is it? Wait, hold on, you can't I'm Oh! Oh, There, looks like it was just a small scratch. Don't worry, you can hardly see it. <gasps> I shipped them so hard! Bandana, yeah! Sally's face armor plus 10. 
Aim for the balls if you ever do. If you're in a life-threatening situation, aim for the balls. I don't know why there's an unspoken code for guys to not suck each other in the nuts. If if I was a dude and some other dude was about to like attack me, I would freaking suck him in the nuts. <laughs> She's so sweet. She wasn't like surprised by his face or anything because he's wearing a mask. Ha! Thanks, Ash. Oh, I ship them. Kiss! Now kiss! <laughs> Dude, what happened? Was it Travis again? That prick, I'll kill him! I hate how I know that you're dead now, bro. Larry, I'm fine, it's okay, don't worry about it. <clears throat> Sal's right, if we stir the pot, it could just make things worse. Not if he's dead. Then he'll probably just haunt the school and we'll be stuck with that bonehead for the next two years. Ha! <laughs> Says the group skeptic. You know I love you guys, but the ghost stories are a bit much, even for me. So we're really just gonna let this Travis thing go? It's not worth it, plus think about it. Who knows what his home life is like? He's got a lot of pent up rage. There must be a reason, that is true. That is true, but there's no excuse to punch somebody, okay? To be fair, he came at you first. Like, he came at you first. You didn't go at him first. Ash is so sweet, I know. Travis got no. I hate how he's dead. I know, right? What the hell? I'm pretty sure he's just angry that they switched Bologna sandwich day to tomorrow. Heh. <laughs> Seriously, I've never seen anyone love the crappiest lunch day so much. It's like prison meal. And he doesn't even like pizza Fridays. Who doesn't like pizza? And it's inhuman. I, I still, I don't know why they showed us that spoiler so early. Like, there has to be a reason. Maybe he's an alien. Ha, that's all we need. Psst, Larry, I'll I'll help you kill Travis when Sal isn't looking. <laughs> I love her. I heard that. I love her. Yes, queen. Yeah, pineapple on pizza though last. Go. That's my favorite. Also, I just I didn't think I mentioned this, but I had pineapple fried rice. Not fell high school. Oh god. That is not sanitary. It ain't about how you look, it's about how clean you are. Does that bologna smell funny to you guys? I thought last week was a little off-putting, but it seems to be worse this week. I heard it's made from goat meat. Hey, ain't nothing wrong with goat meat. I love me some goat meat. <clears throat> Ash supremacy. Real friends plan murders together. Hey, 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 hey. Beautiful. What about pineapple and chick curry? Chicken curry. I'm not opposed to it. I'm. I mean, I just ate the freaking blueberry burger yesterday, <laughs> and I didn't hate it. It was just meh. Yeah, mutton is chewy and yummy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Goat meat is yummy. Didn't a bunch of kids call in sick the day after Bologna Day last week too? Oh, uh, hey, you guys. Don't ruin lunch for me. It's only good. It's the only good part of the day. His name is Chug. <laughs> Group huddle? I'm in. Me too. Count me in. Have fun. I'm gonna stay here with Chug. What's a group huddle? Oh, this is a group huddle. We need to find out if there's anything wrong with this Bologna. 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 I keep calling it Bologna. <clears throat> Maybe there was a batch of bad beef or it's of, if, or it's expired or something. Or bad goats. I'm telling you, dude. This shit is funky. It doesn't taste like no beef to me. This product is most likely like a blend of low-cost meat components from different sources of beef, pork, chicken, and or turkey. That's what cat foods are made of, you know? <laughs> they, they, the cheap brands, the reason why they like have so many ingredients is because they take the cheap parts of all the discarded ingredients and then they mash it up and then they freaking add corn and wheat because it's cheap ingredients to make like cat food so you don't feed that to your cat <laughs> bologna bologna it's not bologna yeah i always called it bologna yeah bologna bologna top man you're making my stomach turn this is like the hot dog incident all over again. Ugh, I hope not. Sal might be on to something. There could be an issue with the lunch meat. I'd like to take our sandwich to the science lab. Genius. And see 
if I can find any bacteria or signs of expiration. However, it would be helpful to know what the exact ingredients are. Okay, Ash. You go with Todd and help him in the lab. Larry and I will try to get more information on the Bologna. 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 Bologna? How do you pronounce it? Bologna? Even though it's N-A? <clears throat> I'm struggling. Sounds like a plant. Maple and Chug. Oh, did we talk to them, maybe? Oh, hi, Larry. Hey, Maple. Aren't you going to eat your lunch? My mom made me peanut butter and jelly again. I'm just kind of tired of it, you know? Uh, I mean, if you're not gonna, of course you can have it, Chug. Heck yes! <laughs> Bless your heart, Chug. He got a pink eye! Travis. I thought I smelled trash. What are you flamers up to? Get bent, Travis. <laughs> Don't you have some sandwiches to attend to? <laughs> You're lucky it's Bologna Day. You look like you got a pink eye. You know what pink eyes are from? <laughs> Just kidding. Free food. Hello, good evening. Bye. Larry's following. Yeah, I love Larry. Your key is so detailed. Can I see it closer for education? Um, sure. Why not? Is that all you want to see? <laughs> this is the closest I could zoom it zoom into. Yes, it's spinning. <laughs> Which key? The necklace? Oh, of course. Who am I to stop you? Who am I to, to stop you from doing research? Study it well. Make me proud. Yes. Graduate top in class. <laughs> you think I didn't know that was what you wanted the whole time? <clears throat> I was just playing. Hey Kim, we wanted to ask about Bologna. Can you please tell us where the school buys it from? Why would you want to know about Bologna? A? Something's wrong with Kim's cooking? I'm just gonna call it Bologna. <laughs> Study respectfully. Still didn't see any key! <laughs> what were you looking at? <laughs> we love science here. Yes. Yes, we do. <laughs> like, always to study. Yes, that's true. I love it! You know, you're hardworking. I respect that. No, no, we were just wondering where it... You kids go and sit back to chairs now. No more questions. Do you think we could just see the package or... No packages for you, just butt in chairs. Go on. Well, that was a failure. She always seems so unhappy. I wonder why she stays here. It's like the kids make her sick or something. Dude, what if... What if Kim is poisoning the lunches? I don't know if this town has room for another conspiracy theory. Though, I guess it's worth looking into. Why don't you see if you can sneak into the principal's office to look at her files? While you do that, I'll check in with Todd. <clears throat> All right, I see what I can do. Sheesh. Hall. I has arrived. Hi, Okami Maida. I googled it. Apparently, it's baloney. Even though it's pronounced, even though there's an A at the end, I think you can rock Sally's hair. Yeah, if I do this, I kind of already have like the two two hair coming out from the side. You know what I mean? <clears throat> Should I just stream like this? Heck, let's just stream like this. <laughs> I'm not talking to Travis no more. Hall. Alright. Okay. Knockfell prep pep rally courtyard. Wait, he's here. Okay, let's go to the right side and see what's there. Male's toilet, boy's room, girl's room. Lockers. Let's go check out the boy's room. B-b-b-b-bitsuni, like I want to go into a boy's room. B-b-b-b-bitsuni. Yeah, girl. Hey. Lasagna. Lasagna. Bologna. See, study it a few more times and everyone 
in chat in the chat will apply to Harvard. Are you sure you want to get to Harvard? You probably won't have a great time there, would you? Stall. Am I gonna see a ghost? Oh no. I don't want to go into the girls' bathroom because Sally's a boy. But Sally identify as a girl, so let's go to the girls' bathroom. I don't know. I don't know how that works. I better not. Yeah, true. <laughs> it's locked. If I have paperclip, I could get it. Paperclip. Cafeteria. There's a class in there right now. Oh, we stealing paperclips. Oh, there it is. Oh, nice! Cute. Oh, okay. Check in with Todd. We talk about deep stuff in there sometimes. Really, really, really? That's where you talk about life? Really, really? Mr. Pecker Peckers Peckerton's classroom. Okay. I can't math, so whatever the hell that was on the, de on the, on the whiteboard was a lot to me. Hall 2 Science lab <laughs> Hi Find anything? Not yet, were you able to get the bologna ingredients? No, not yet Where's Ash? She went to get some materials for me I recommended she look in the janitor's closet I thought she'd be back by now, actually Alright, be right back I think she's caught up and we probably have to go get her <clears throat> Courtyard. Oh, hey. Hey, girl. Hey, you cute. <laughs> Nothing going on in the guy's room. Really? I wouldn't know. Hey, what's wrong? The damn closet is locked. I need something in there to test the bologna. I tried to pick the lock like Larry showed me, but now my hairpin is stuck in a keyhole. It's jammed up good. Could use some pliers to get that out, but yeah, they'd be in the closet or with the janitor, but he's he, he always leaves for lunch. I'll see what I can find. Thanks. In the meantime, I'm gonna keep trying to get this out. Hey. Let's go check up on our buddy before we go out in the courtyard. How about that? Also, why is it that all schools' floors look like this in America? Or like in the Western world? Bologna. Where's my friend? Oh, hello? Any luck? The teachers are all in the lounge. I'm waiting for the right moment to sneak by. Okay. Let's go to the courtyard. And then after that, we'll pe The teachers are in there. I need to find a way to get their attention without them may see me. Maybe I'll make a loud noise. Okay, let's go pick the lock. We'll pick the lock and then we'll go to the courtyard. Hi, Takatakum. Hello. Oh. Larry's backpack. We've been through so much over the last two years. He's more than my best friend. He's family now. I don't know what I'd do without him. That's one of my paintings. I was gonna throw it out, but Larry insists on keeping it. He said, "Great artist doesn't need, great art doesn't need to be beautiful as long as it conveys genuine emotions." And I feel like, and I feel a shit out of this man. I really do. I didn't want to read that again. Lockers. Larry's locker. Todd's locker. Let's go to Sal's locker. So some of my textbooks, Todd suggests that I take physics this year and I'm actually enjoying it. The world lives, we live in is fascinating and filled with mystery. Nope. Go. I've had this backpack since I started going to school here. It's a little worn around the edges. A picture of us from Halloween. That was so fun. I'm so lucky to have such great friends. Aww. E Must protect. Ash, let's go to Ash's locker. Did we just pick her lock? Her locker? Is this horror game? Yes, this is. Larry's in the bass, bro. Yeah. Hi, Cakes. Case. Cakes. Case. How do you pronounce your name? Cakes. Case. Keys. Keys. Yeah, that's so wholesome. Ash makes these stuffed dolls. I think they're cool. She calls them little dudes. Ash's, Ash's art supplies. Ash and Larry are such good artists. They try to teach me, but I'll never be as good as they are. It's okay. I have fun painting and drawing with them, and they never make me feel bad for not being good at it. That's so sweet. 
Ash's Polaroid camera. She's always snapping pictures with it. This could come in handy. I'm, I'm sure she won't mind if I borrow it. Let's take it. I would hate to, but... What's the point of this game? Some of Ash's photos. One is an older picture of her and Larry. I'm so glad I met those two. Are they a thing? Oh, hey, that's me. I didn't know she had this in her locker. Oh, oh my. Wait, no, we were going to Larry's. A Todd. Todd is never short on supplies for his inventions. I don't know how he does half the things he does. The guy's a genius. This potato light thingy was a science experiment that Todd showed in class. I'm surprised it's still going. Holy smokes! I want to eat soft cakes right now. Eh. <clears throat> Cake. Cake. Is that how you pronounce your name? Cake? Cakes? Cakes? Case? Case. K-E-I-X. Case. Cakes. Hmm. That's kind of hard. <gasps> that Todd and his boyfriend, Neil, let's go! LGBTQ! They're always so happy when they're together. That makes me happy too. I love this. I love this game. 10 out of 10. Not much of a surprise that Todd's locker is half filled with books. I really admire his passionate curiosity and hunger for knowledge. Hey, that is so cute. I love it. We love, we love a progressive game. You know what I mean? How do I close? Cancel. Go close, close, close. Oh, here we go. Oh, so these are all the same. Lockers, lockers, cells, locker. Yeah, I mean. Heh. Nothing in the lockers. Cafeteria. Huh. Just call them cakes. <laughs> I, hmm. You know what? That's fine. I will drop by your channel and see um, how you pronounce your own name. Because that's usually what I do. <laughs> I don't think there's anything here. Let's go outside and see if we can distract the teachers. Excellent. Hey y'all, uh, good morning! Good morning? Hi Endo! What time is it? <laughs> Am I streaming in the morning? Oh, there's a ball up there. Shake. Nice. Tennis ball. Found in the courtyard. Alright. It's almost 9 p.m. Man. I miss the time when I was nocturnal because I was so just inspired by music and just. I don't know what it is about nighttime, but it makes you feel so inspired. I can see them, they must be hiding. Nighttime makes you feel good about life, especially when you get enough sleep. Teachers are in there. Maybe I could throw this. Throw it. Huh? What was that? I don't know. It sounded like it came from outside. I don't see anything. Neither do I. Maybe it was those damn birds again. Throwing that tennis ball really distracted the, te the teachers. Let's throw it again. <laughs> Alright, let's go in. How are you? I'm feeling much better for sure. Um, I felt a little sick yesterday. And this morning, I felt like kind of groggy. But I had a great time streaming on Twitch. Uh, we progressed a lot in Resident Evil Village. We're gonna do it again tomorrow. Hopefully we can finish the game. But yeah, it's always fun to stream on Twitch because we can play with the, the stream avatars. Yeah. So yeah, how, how are you? How are you? Thank you for asking. Must be the side effects from a blueberry burger. I'm like this every day. Don't make one hi. How are you? I walk, 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 walk. Did you get past? Yeah, good thinking with that distraction dude, I saw her file. Awesome, anything to help us? Well, I had to book it, so I didn't get a good look really. If you can distract the teachers again, maybe I can just take the file? Well, we don't want to draw attention to ourselves by stealing the file. Alright, you're the boss, Sally, so what should we do? Give me a minute, I'll think of something. Here, use Ash's camera to take a photo of the files. Great thinking, dude, really ready when you are. Wouldn't it go It's a Polaroid, right? It goes Showtime. Bro. Huh? What was that? I don't know. It sounded like it came from outside. I don't see anything. Neither do I. Maybe it was those damn birds again. 
They don't realize they said the same dialogue twice. <laughs> Gotta go! Thanks for the stream! Have a, have a nice day, good night! Thank you so much, Kato, for coming! I hope you have a wonderful night, sleep well, thank you! Otsu, otsukare! I wish Twitch wasn't asking me personal questions every time I need to do something on there. They make, they make, they do that to you? 3 a.m. is the best time to do anything. 3 a.m. when you have enough sleep and you're just staying up for the sake of staying up. I don't know, it feels a little exciting, it feels a, a little fun. Just me? I don't know. Did you get it? Dude, the file's missing. What? How can that be? No one else would have went in there without you seeing them. Heh, <laughs> just jerking your chain, man. I got the picture. Oh, you butt nozzle. <laughs> Score! Let's take a look at it. Butt nozzle. Kim Yazi. I don't know what to do. I think I know what to do. I'll meet you back in the lab. Wait, let's read this. Okay. 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 Lunch. Lunch lady. Position. Lunch lady. Education. GED. Previous employment. Amateur nature photographer. No, it's Kim has elephantiasis. It's not contagious and she is sensitive to it. Make sure the other teachers the other teachers know. Tell Kim to stop feeding the birds in the courtyard. Other teachers are getting annoyed. You got it, dude. Is it like bird meat? That doesn't make sense. I can't believe Larry was able to get into the principal office with all the teachers right next door. Front door. I can't leave. We need to finish this investigation. What are we supposed to do again? Get Bologna from Kim. How are we gonna do that? In the morning when no one's gonna disturb you, everyone's asleep and you, they leave you alone. Woo! Yeah. Never got any questionable... Questionnaire from Twitch. Huh. 3 a.m. was when we feel suddenly hungry out of nowhere. I know, yes. But like, I don't know. It feels so exciting to stay up at night. Like, a, there's the kind of tinkliness. Skedaddle boy, leave me in peace. What do you want? They have crazy hair color. Hey Sally Face, how's the detective work going? Not great so far, but we're still looking into it. You guys are wasting your time on this one, I'm telling you. This is good bologna, nothing wrong with it. Everything tastes good to you, buddy. Heh, <laughs> she has a point there, Chug. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In any event, I hope you're right. Should we go talk to our friends in the lab then? Mr. Mrs. Peckerson, Peckerton's classroom. What do I want? I want you. I want you under my skin. No matter one. Hey, <laughs> that was an old TVXQ song. Old K-pop song. Where's the science lab? Oh, science lab. Hey, hey, you get that bologna yet, dude? Working on it. Frick. What are you? What am I supposed to do? Question mark, question mark. Oh, sticky tack. Just got a sticky tack. All right. All right. Now what do we do with the sticky tack? <gasps> Are we gonna feed it to the birds? Please don't feed it to the birds. I mean, I guess she would be worried because she seemed worried for the birds. Sally? Huh. Sally, no. It's kind of fun to play with. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I was scared that would be an option. That would be fucked up. How are you? Hi, Biggie Cheese. How are you? I'm, I am, I'm okay. I can say that. I'm okay. How about you? How are you? I hope you're feeling good today. It is a Sunday. Help Ash. Help Ash. Oh yeah, where is she? That's true. That's true. I forgot about my girlfriend. <laughs> I forgot about my girlfriend Ash. <laughs> Don't tell her. She throw a fit. <laughs> the stick will be the stick will be a sword. The stick. You gotta throw it at the birds as a distraction. No, I think maybe maybe you could use a sticky tack to get the pin out. It's worth a shot. 
Oh, here we go. Oh, thanks. Awesome, we came out and I was able to get the door unlocked too. I must have been close to getting it open with a pin. Alright, now that I've got what I need, time to head back to the old lab. Cool, I'll meet you and Todd in a little while. I have to figure out a way to get the ingredients first. Maybe we could go in. Can we find something to use? Hmm. Huh. She was born in 1967. Holy smokes. Alright. What can we use? Can we throw this at her? <laughs> That's so bad. I'm tired. It's 12 a.m. Oh, Lord. You should get some rest. Yeah, you should, re you should really get some rest. I mean, it's always a pleasure to have you here, but I want you to rest. Maybe I won't be too loud so you can fall asleep to this stream. Except for this stream, the music is all like rock. <laughs> <laughs> the music is freaking loud. Our girlfriend are fine. Sally's not that horrible. <laughs> I see the worst in people. <laughs> what if I throw it at him? Is he. Does he have like church flyers or something? Because look, it's like blue flyers with a cross on it. You go into church, then you should act like you serve the Lord. Don't act like a freaking little demon. <laughs> All right, maybe I could use something here. That's so mean if I take a photo of her. Hmm. I mean, the only thing we can do is to the birds. Because it just says like there are birds outside. Hope they didn't see me. Can we use something? Maybe throw it once more? Throw. Huh? What was that? I don't know. It sounded like it came from... I didn't see anything. Neither did I. Maybe it was those damn birds again. See? Huh. I don't want to throw this. Oh god. Ah! Oh. Bird! Where are the birds at? Chirp, chirp, motherfuckers! I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Where are they? Sounds like they're coming from the right side. Am I getting close? Am I getting close? Oh! Oh! There we are! It's cute! Frame. There were always Bible pushing jerks in school, the not so much from my high school, but most of them had them. Oh, wow. Trigger warning, I just remember it's probably best to put, if I put a TW, this chapter gets pretty gory, so if anyone is sensitive to stuff like that, I'll get a heads up when it's coming, if you need it. Are you sure? Here. I'm gonna pin this, thank you so much, but are you sure you wanna stay up? I feel so bad. Today's gameplay might be a little long. Got a photo. <laughs> she said, "Chirp, chirp, motherfucker." Um. All right. Let's let's go show her. Looky, we have a photo of the Barbie. Hi. Hey, bestie. Look at what I got. Oh. Wait. Oh, here we go. I got something for you. What's this? A photograph of Birdie? You take pictures, eh? Yeah, I took it for you. Just a small thanks for all the hard work you do. You're sweet boy, Sally. Thank you. So I was wondering, can you tell me where the school buys the Bologna farm? Why are you so interested in Bologna for? Ugh, well, my friends and I really like it and want to know where we can get some. It's local bait. It's local made by Mrs. Peckerton. 100% beef. She brings from farm once a week. Here, I give you some extra meats for bringing Kim nice photographs. Ayo, thank you so much. So now we can go to the lab. And now we can go examine. What does it look like? What does it look like this? Oh, because it's slime. Oh, okay, okay. Bird's eye view. Slimy has a strong odor. Heh. <laughs> it's alright. I don't have... 
I don't sleep much anyway. I have pretty bad insomnia. If I'm gonna wake up, I'd rather stay up watching my favorite VTuber. Ah, oh, <laughs> thank you. Try to make this entertaining for you so you don't fall asleep. <laughs> it's Bologna. Yep, got more Bologna. Perfect. Kim said that it's made by Mr. Packer Mrs. Packerton. Well, no way, dude. She lives in the apartments. How could she make her own lunch meats? Oh yeah, I forgot she lives there. I hardly ever see her. I've probably seen her in the building twice since I moved here. She tends to return at late hours. I believe she keeps multiple jobs. Teachers don't get paid as well as you may think, so it's fairly common. However, when Mrs. Packerton is home, she makes quite a lot of noise. It's very peculiar. <gasps> oh no! Wait, is she the one with a in her room? Is she the one with the with the sawing noise coming from her room? I thought that was a dude's room. 100% beef, eh? I know! Hey, Asu! Yeah, right? So what do we do? Should we ask Packerton about this odd side business of hers? Are you boys going to do your detective thing? Heh, <laughs> I don't know. What do you think, Sal? Let's do a little snooping before going to Packerton. I don't like the way this is playing out. If something nefarious is going on, it's best not to let Packerton know that we're looking into it. Agreed. Good call, Sally. Alright, why don't you and Larry go check out Mr. Packerton's classroom while the teachers are on break? Todd and I will finish testing this Bologna. Exactly what I was thinking. Okay, we'll be back. Human me question mark, question mark, human beef question mark. Larry, I'll need you to be my lookout. Wait by the door in case anyone comes down here. You got it. Desk. Damn, she keeps her desk drawers locked. Do you remember how to pick a lock like I showed you? Yeah, but there's no keyhole. A comma lock? Shit, dude. How the hell are we gonna get that thing open? Let me take a look at it. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I am not about to do the math. I'm not to, about to do the math. On the freaking... Can you guys do it? <laughs> do you think you can solve it? I'm too stupid for this. I didn't fail math class to like come back to this. <laughs> Let's go! Okay, what is this supposed to be? Oh, 3141. 3141. Ah! Got it open! You wanna know why? Look at the pie, look at the pie, look at the pie, look at the pie. There's a box. The rest of the words are like italic after it. Well, not the rest of them, but like, yeah. Hey, yo! Got it open. Nice one, dude. What's inside? Just a bunch of math papers and... Hold on, there's a hidden compartment. Man, there's some freaky stuff in here. What is it? I'm not sure. <gasps> the little jar is filled with what looks like spices. Maybe for cooking? Why does she have a bird skull in here? It's kind of creepy. It's a Bible. This looks really old, but there isn't anything special about it. Strange metal objects similar to Jim's puzzle box. This could be important. There's another one of these- Oh, shit. Is it happening again? Yeah, I- Horror. You- What? Um... S s what? You- What? You did you just call me a whore? Did you just call me a whore? I think I just spelled out a word whore. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, hurry, something that. Are you sure you could just be dehydrated? You didn't eat anything for lunch either. It's done. Huh? It's already over. But never mind. Let's go check in with Todd and Ashley. Okay. Hey guys, we found some sketchy things in, the Pack in Packerton's desk. Our, how are the tasks coming? We're not getting any signs of harmful chemicals or bacteria. However, I think we can all agree there's something peculiar going on here. Whatever it is, let's not mention this to Chug for now. The poor kid almost had a heart attack when they stopped serving meatloaf. <laughs> we did backwards. I tried. I tried. It still didn't make sense. Who said that? Who said that? Who said I'm a whore? Show yourself. Yeah, Ash is right. Let's keep this under wraps until we know for sure what's going on. Well, I guess we know what we have to do now. Damn, I'm gonna miss the action again. I have to watch Ben until my parents get home. Maybe I can help out after that, though. Later that day. I need a few minutes to get ready. 
That's cool. I have to take care of some things first anyway. Okay, let's meet up in Toss room once everyone's ready. Yes, perfect. Cool. <laughs> We're back in the apartment, y'all. Yeah, reading backwards and with still nonsense. Yeah, is it the missing letters? I'm not sure, honestly. Key card and this. Strange metal object. I'm not sure what it is. Similar to Jim's puzzle box. Must be important. Who the hell is Jim again? We just went into some lady's house. Oh, it's the grandma. Hello, everyone, dear Sally. You sound tired. Are you okay? Yes, yes, I'm quite fine. I was just a bit distracted by my thoughts. You know me. Did you finish that book you were reading? I did. You seem to be enjoying it. What's wrong? You didn't like the ending? Most stories' endings are a lie we tell ourselves to create a false sense of hope. What do you mean? There are no happy endings in life, Sal. We all get the same terrible ending, death. I feel like we've been through this conversation before. You can't know that for sure, Rose. And even if that were true, doesn't that make life more, even more precious? It's our one chance to shine as brightly as we can before the long night claims us. That's why I try to live life the best I can, just in case it's the only one I get. Not for you, my boy. Huh? Oh, never mind, child. I admire your optimistic view of life. It's just something I long lost. I've lost long ago. I'm afraid. Okay, so deep. You're trying to tell me that you're trying to. You know something, but you're just not telling me. I love her, <laughs> Grandma. I don't even know. I'm young. Oh, hello, CCTV. Unt, 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 unt. <laughs> Mrs. Gibson's place. What do you want, Sal? Just wanted to see how you were doing. I may be old, but I can take care of myself. Thank you very much. Huh. Doesn't look like it. It looks like you have stopped taking care of yourself. As a matter of fact, it looks like you stopped for like 30 years. Addison's tea. Oh, he put, <laughs> he put up posters now. That is so cute. Rose is a great character. Yeah. Good evening, Sally. How are you on this fine day? Hey, Mr. Addison, I'm good. How are you? I'm swell, young sir. Do you like the new sign? I love it. Thanks to you and Larry. It almost feels like I have my own little tea house now. I do miss, uh, miss giving out my tea to tenants. <laughs> However, I simply couldn't afford to keep up with that. I'm glad you like it, and I think it's totally reasonable to charge for the tea. Everyone understands. That's wonderful to hear. Any new tenants? I'm afraid not, though we have someone coming to look at a room next week. So, I, so hope is on the horizon, I suppose. I'm sure your luck will improve soon, Terrence. And if there's anything you ever need help with, don't hesitate to ask. That's very kind of you, so thank you. I'll keep that in mind. We are so kind. I love that. Good day. This is so cute. This is so wholesome. No one lives there. Mail. Henry Fisher, Henry Fisher, Henry Fisher, junk. Oh, hey, Sal Fisher. There's a the letter for me. Hmm, no, no return address on it. That's weird. It's an empty envelope. What the heck? Okay, so now we have... Oh, we don't have... Interesting. Okay. Meet in 202. Hmm. Two. Yeah. Sally is a kind kid. He didn't deserve the charges. Yeah, he seems so nice. 202. Yep, Todd's place. No one's home. Hey girl, hey, how you doing? Oh. Oh, <laughs> she looks high as hell. <laughs> she looks like she's on cloud nine. <laughs> Hi, Mrs. Morrison. Hey, Sally, are the boys off to another adventure? Something like that. I think that's just so wonderful. Life is full of potential adventures and beautiful mysteries that are just waiting to be explored and experienced. You're totally right about that. Yeah, just gotta seize the moment though. Sometimes it's nice to relax on the couch after a long day, you know? Ray and I were just watching some television and then he passed out. He passed right out like a little baby. Isn't he just the cutest? Aww. I'm sure, I guess so, but you guys don't have a TV. Yeah, isn't it so nice without all the noise? Uh, yeah, we're about to get going. She is high off her head. She has a bong next to her and all. <laughs> I'm quoting you on saying Sally face is so cute and wholesome. Yeah. Hi, Dexter Reed. Hello. Do you see this baby photo? I just want to say. <laughs> he's, swim he's swimming in his... <laughs> he's swimming in his own poop. 
That's so bad. But he looks so happy. That's terrible. AI art confirmed. This one, AI art confirmed. AI art confirmed. Yep. <laughs> All right. I suppose we're gonna go just go to his his room. <laughs> Oh, that's the parents' room. Alright. Hello! Question mark. What's the new gadget? Oh, you weren't supposed to see that yet. I was. It was going to be a surprise. What is it? Among other things, it's a portable amplifier with custom effects that can be used to upgrade your guitar. That's amazing, Todd. You're a genius. I can't wait to try it out. Unfortunately, you have to wait a while. There's still a few parts I'm waiting on in the mail. Besides, we have more important things to discuss on... To focus on at the moment. Right. Keyboard ASMR? I approve. Mm -hmm. Are you ready? Sure. Before we get this started, you may want to get your super gear boy. Just in case. Oh yeah, good thinking. I'll be right back. Alright, I think we're going back to our room. Which is on the what? Fourth floor? Let's go. Fourth floor. Can we check this? Oh, never mind. <laughs> I, I stepped in and went four, four, four. Nobody lives here. <laughs> I yeeted. I said, oh, hell to the no. <laughs> spooky, yes. Yeah, spooky. Where's our cat? into working again tonight. I'll be home late. There are some leftovers in the fridge if you don't want to eat with Lisa and Larry. I'm sorry you haven't been available much lately. Maybe we can go do something this weekend. Love, Dad. <laughs> he pays the rent. I was just so surprised. <laughs> I was so surprised. Oh my gosh. I didn't expect that. What the hell? <laughs> Rare side of a cat enjoying bath. Yeah. Super gear boy. Right, we got it. Teacup. All right. <laughs> I was. <laughs> it's so cute. It's so cute. I love it. Maybe we could take something from Dad's room. Question mark. There's something under the bed. It's an old photo of Mom. I thought Dad threw them all away. Hi, Mom. I miss you. I hope that you're at, you're at peace. There's a handwritten note on the back. Henry, you are you are my sunshine. Okay, you are my sunshine in the darkness. I can't believe we're going to have a little boy. <gasps> I'm so unbelievably happy. Happy, everything's perfect. Love you always, Diane. Aww, that's so sweet. That's computer. It's on, but I don't know his password. Maybe I could figure it out. I don't. I don't really want to do this right now, bro. Aww. All right. <clears throat> Hi, Night Owl. How are you? His mother was a lovely woman. Aw. She sounded so sweet. I would have loved to meet her. Or maybe we will. What do we know? All right. We're going back to level two. Second floor. I was good. Hey. Hello. Are you ready? Yeah. I've tapped into the security cameras and we'll be will be able to loop footage off the empty hallway until you get you two get back. Be careful. What are we doing now? Oh, got it. Nice. We should go quick before she comes back. 
was that music? Hello? Dude, it smells like ass in here. Ass and old feet. <laughs> Good lord, we better make this a short visit. I can't take that stench for too long. Check out that painting. What if Packerton really does just work on a farm? I don't know. That painting gives me a weird feeling, like a cold chill. Whoa, yeah, I feel it too. Let's take a look around. Radio. It's needed. All radio, but it won't turn on. Must be broken. Diapers. There's a big thing of diapers. Do you think Mrs. Packerton, Packerton used them for herself? <laughs> Probably do. Packerton is ancient. Oh, that's fucked up. What? Anything strange in the fridge? No, it looks like normal groceries and stuff. But there's a padlock on the freezer. Can you get it to open? Yeah, just give me a minute. This bit is very gory. Oh, lord. Ew, bathtub. When's the last time she cleaned this bathroom? Ew! Ugh, gross, there's a big old log in there. Ew! Wait, what? Did I just take... Oh, no, okay. I thought he said got it, as in he took the... He took it. Alright, let's open it up. Okay, satanic. I knew it! 1047. It is goats. I fucking call that shit, man. Also gross. I feel like it can't be that simple. Let's see if we can get into those bedrooms. All right. What is it again? 1047. 1047. 1047, guys. Write it down. Write it down. I forget. It gets worse. Oh, Lord. All right, guys. Trigger warnings. It's locked. There's some weird mechanism on the clock. On the knob. Clock's hands stuck at 314. If I try to move them, they just go right back. 314. It's a bizarre lock, dude. I'm not sure if I can pick it, but I'll keep trying. Hmm. What do I do? Shift and activate it by pressing R. I don't know. I don't know. I don't remember how to use this thing. <laughs> oh! Eee! Um, hi, little buddy? Ba! Ba, ba! Ba! Ba, ba! What in the hell was that? A ghost goat, apparently. That shouldn't be surprising to me at this point, but I definitely did not see that coming. What? What? Okay, so now what? Now what? Eh? 13... What's it called? What was the pa- what? 1047. One zero four seven. Huh? One zero four seven, right? <laughs> Reference to pie, huh? What happened to my dinner? Don't tell me I'm finding ghosts in a poopy place. <laughs> we find love in a hopeless place. Is it the same goat? Hey there, Mr. Goat. Ba, 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 ba. Ba, 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 she have you anymore. Change the lock to 1212? Why is it 1212? What clue would we get for 1212? It's locked. One. It's either the radio or the clock. One, two, one, two. Oh, that unlocked the first bedroom. Let's check it out. Uh oh. There's someone in here. Those are diapers! Oh my gosh, hello? 
Mr. Packerton, hello? I don't think he hears you. You're right, looks like he's in some kind of vegetative state. Man, this is fucked up. Definitely that rancid smell is coming from here too. Yuck, let's take a quick look around and get out of here. All these papers talking about the death of Mr. Packerton. If he's dead, then who's laying in that bed? All I want to know is what the hell are there so many shit-filled diapers in here? Like seriously, like what the fuck? I know what you mean. The apartment is making me feel super nauseous. You don't think she uses the... No, no, never mind. I don't even want to think about that. I think if the mystery ingredient was human shit, Todd would have seen some signs in that. Signs of that in the lab, right? I guess so. Well, honestly, I have no idea. Let's just hurry up in here. Mr. Peckerton? Are you Mr. Peckerton? Blink if you can hear me. Hello? Blink! Young child, please help me. How could you be? Are you dead? I am in between, suffering for what seems like an eternity. Did Mrs. Packerton do this? We were in love once, or so I thought. Yes, this is her doing. Please, you must help me escape the endless agony. What's in the Bologna? Bologna, I'm afraid I don't know much about that. This room is my prison, my tomb of infinite sorrow. I can never leave in this state. How can I help you? You must unplug this horrid machine. But isn't that, wouldn't that... It will end my suffering. It will free me from this torment. But are you sure? Please, child, I beg of you. You must hurry before she returns. This has got to be a chat. This has got to be a chat decision. Okay, I can't make this myself. Pool? No spoilers. No spoilers. We'll just, we'll just decide as the chat goes. I will vote yes. My vote is yes. What are your votes? Oh, most of the people are voting yes. Pull the plug so we can charge our phone. <laughs> That's it. He's like, quick, my Mobile Legends is still running. My phone is running out of battery. I'm ranking. <laughs> That's just nasty. I know. Yo, that's so sad. It's so fucked up. My goodness gracious. I feel so sad for him. Oh, no. Man, priorities. <laughs> is it really in our, is it really our place to pull the plug, though? Shouldn't we, like, notify the police? I feel like that would be more, I think that would be, like, let the police do it. You know, like, at least they come and there's proof. Excuse me, of her holding him hostage. Excuse me. Hi, Porfirio. Welcome. I arrived. I don't even know what pulling will do. We're pulling the plug to to take his um take his what do you call it? Take his life or not? Because he's suffering. He's begging us as a ghost to to pull the plug, and and we're deciding whether we should do it or not. Yeah, he's begging for death. They cover up his body. Oh no! No way, Biggie! That's a spoiler. Stop, Biggie! No spoilers! God damn it! <laughs> no spoilers, Biggie. If someone else can take the blame, always let them. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I mean, she seems dangerous. If she's holding somebody hostage and she's willing to live with the poop, the smell of poop, she needs to go to jail. She needs to get locked up because she's a little cuckoo. You know what I mean? And the police need to get her because they're not gonna ever trust my word. God damn it, Diggy, Biggie. <laughs> yeah. It's like a gotcha pool. <laughs> All right, fine. All right, fine. 82% of you guys want me to pull. All right, let's see if we pull a waifu. All right. We're doing it. We're doing it. Pull for the waifus. We pull. <laughs> it's so sad. All right, F in the chat. F in the chat. Oh my god. We better get out of here. I hope that was the right thing to do. You didn't have a choice, man. The poor guy was in so much pain. It's what he wanted. Yeah, I guess so. I just... Oh shit, she's back. Quick, behind that dresser. What dresser? If you don't make it out alive, I... I love you, dude. I love you too, man. You're the best friend I've ever, I've ever had, you know? Same to you, little bud. Oh my god. Uh, is it her? Oh, hey, 
sorry to ruin a moment. What the hell is this place? Ashley, you scared the crap out of us. I can see that. Heh, <laughs> man, Emma glad to see you, Ash. I thought we were done for. I thought you had to watch Benjamin. My dad came home early, so I rode over here straight away. Sorry for giving you guys a scare. I... Is that Mr. Packard? Mr. Packerton? Is he... It was him. He's gone now. He's finally at peace. Da damn. Please don't tell me this is what is going on in a Bologna. I hope not. I'm not sure. There's still one room we haven't looked into yet. We need to get in there before we leave. Oh, check this out. Where we were hiding, I found this key under the dresser. Let's go! One of these keys has to open the other ba ba bedroom. Let's go. Anything to get out of this room. What the hell are you waiting for? We're in! Ah! Oh, what in the... Oh my god! Examine wall. This can't be good. Freezer. Another damn combo lock. What is it again? What was the number again? Very big trigger warning, guys. Examine. It's like some kind of slaughter factory in here. Talk. This room gives me the creeps, man. Me, me too. It's Major Creepsville in here. What was the number again? 1047? There's no zero. There's no zero. There's no zero. 1212? Nope. Is it 1047? 3142. Oh, yeah, the pie. 3142. Nope. This is 3142, right? Eh. Can I, can we get out? Me too, man. Yo, man, let me out. I want to find clues. Unless it's in here. Morse codes? Do you guys read Morse, Morse codes? 5142. Where's the freezer? No. Do you guys read Morse codes? The Morse codes on the wall. Maybe the blood spots. Four two four two. No. Four. What is that? What is that? Four. One, 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 two, one, one, two, one, three. One, four, one, three. Let's try. Oh, one, four, one, three. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's humans. We're in our in we're in way over our heads here. We need to get help. There are no bones. What? There aren't any bones in here. It's all just <gasps> meat. Dude, no, come on. You are leaving evidence here. Oh god, he did. Ash is right. We should get help. Don't you see there's no one who can help us? Every time something happens here, it's covered up. The cult look Charlie, Mr. Sanderson, everyone, everyone, who knows what else this place is hidden. We can't trust the cops and we can't tell our parents because they want to go to the police. They haven't believed in anything we've told them about. Then what do we do? I don't know, man. Things just keep getting worse. Packerton's chopping people up and serving them to... Ugh. I don't think I'll ever look at Bologna the same ever again. So, um... Wait! Tell us the rest of the damn story! Well? Well what? You asked why I don't eat the bologna and I've told you why. Of all the fantastical stories you like to spin, you're really not going to tell us what happens next. <laughs> this costing shrat. Can I get a boneless human? Is that a leather face house? Oh my god. No wonder it tastes really good kilav? Question mark. Why bother? You probably don't believe what I've said up until now. Anyways, 
And anyways, and the story just gets more and more unbelievable from this point. Plus, you're probably going to cut it up and make me sound like a lunatic on TV. Give us the rest of the story and we're, we'll air in its entirely. Entirety. Without cuts, I promise you. I don't know, man. Your your news channel is called fake news, like faux news, so I don't know. <laughs> I heard you mention Todd Morrison's name before we started. Did you visit him? They won't let me they won't tell me anything here. Yeah, we shot a segment on him yesterday. Is he okay? Is he still in the hospital? I'll tell you what, you finish the Bologna story and I'll tell you about Todd. <gasps> we are getting a continuous Oh! Frey! Man, this game takes me back to my emo face. Oh, Lord! What do you mean? What? Which aspect? This dude has a scar on his face. Yeah, he does. Spot the cannibal. Oh, Lord. Arby's recipe is odd. A question mark? Before he left, Miss, left Mrs. Packerton's room, Ash noticed something else. Hey, guys, come look at this. Ah! Oh. There's some kind of trash chute hiding behind that painting. That's weird, this building doesn't have trash chutes. It doesn't look like it goes outside and there's no light coming in. Be careful, Ash. I wonder where it leads. Ah! Oh. She's dead. Our girlfriend is dead. We don't have no girlfriend no more. Ash! Ash, are you okay? Ash! Oh no, 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 this can't be happening. Please let her be okay. We have to find where this leads to. How are we? What are we? I'm gonna shimmy down. It's the only way. No, dude, you're not thinking straight. What if you fall too or land on her? If she's still alive, that could heal her. Okay, yeah, you're right. Let's think. Alright. Um... I don't <laughs> I can't speak properly god damn it is what back to being single <laughs> back to being single before valentine's don't have nobody no loved one to spend christmas with i know where this goes what how never mind just go get Todd and meet me in the basement I didn't solve that, bro. You, 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 you did that all yourself. I didn't... What's going on, Sal? What did you see? Is Ashley alright? Everything's going to be okay. Come help me with this. No one has used this apartment in a long time. It's in a rough shape, but Edison can't afford the renovations it needs, just like the fifth floor. Is this what you saw in your vision, Sal? It doesn't work exactly like that. It's more like a feeling of heightened intuition. Transformers as a Vax. Hi, Bobby! We still have Larry. She was the imposter all along. She vented. Alright, you lead the way. Larry and I will offer support however we can. I want to find out so bad what is going on. It's locked. Wait, one of those keys from Packerton's look like the old apartment keys. Try that out. Oh yeah, I almost forgot about those. Perfect. Hello, girlfriend? Are you alive? There's nothing in here. Give me a minute to look around. Okay, I could do this, not here. <coughs> Excuse me, let me drink some. Bros before hoes. <laughs> sus, among us vent, vent, sus. I know, right? I guess we could walk around with this on. Doesn't help, doesn't hurt. Wait. Is that shadow on a corner or it just looks like somebody pissed at it every single time for like one whole line? And so it looks like the pee soaked into the carpet and the wallpaper? Question mark. Bedroom one. Oh, that's my dad. With his chronic coughing. That's why kids don't smoke. <clears throat> oh. It's ripped. 
Carpet. The carpet is torn up here. Looks like. Guys, come check this out. I can't unsee it after you say it. <laughs> Why does she look like she's about to go cheat? Chi chi ha ha ha. Is that a reference? Which which reference? She understands the Among Us language. The Among Us speech. The language of the gods. It's a dungeon. Dude, there must be an undocumented sub basement level. It's definitely not in any of the blueprints that I've seen. Perhaps an old dirt cellar or something of the like. I had no idea this was here. The third key from Mrs. Packers fits in this door. Ashmi must be down there. It's the only place the shoot would lead to. But what if it's not? But what if it's not, y'all? bad incredible this architecture must date back multiple centuries at least centuries of blood and demon worship this is freaky as hell everything is coated in thick layers of dust which likely mean the area is presently vacant and has been for a while presently vacant sorry let's hope that the malevolent history of this place remains in the past yeah well we need to get through that gate somehow there appears to be an absence of any obvious mechanisms to move the large gate they must be built into the walls it's likely that the appar apparatus for opening the gate is hidden we better split up and search the room is she sacrificed can i take a screenshot I'm going to take a screenshot for my future thumbnail. Can I? Let's do it. Don't mind me. <laughs> Just working hard, okay? I make my own thumbnails. I've always made my own thumbnails. Okay. Maybe not always, but nowadays. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> All right. Examine. An old leather-bound book with a symbol of a goat's head on a cover. The text is written in a lot of language and the pages smell like rotten flesh. What? This book gives me an oddly strong sensation of deja vu. Hi mom, I'm on TV! Say <laughs> Hello? You got anything? It's a bit strange this place has... Like this has light bulbs. They must have been installed later on. This green bulb in particular is fascinating. I've never seen a bulb quite like it. How do you turn it on? That's another mystery. There are no visible switches. I've looked all over around this area. Huh. Can I use this? Ayo? Turn it up. Turn it up. Hey, boy. What's with all the spikes? Like, dude, you can't turn around without stubbing your toe. Like, shit hurts like hell, too. <laughs> maybe you could... Maybe you could... No. An old leather-bound book. There's a symbol on the cover. A bird within a circle. The text is written in another language, so I can't read it. Blood is spat splattered on some of the pages, and the book is burnt across the bottom edge. Yeah, feeling cheesy. <laughs> cheesy! Scary, yes. Say magic word to turn on like ab abracadabra. Or what do Amogus say as a secret language? Touching this makes me feel lightheaded as if it's producing a strange energy. Okay. Alright. Screw it on. Okay, dude, those little obelisk things thingy just got bigger. Scope it out. Huh. All right. I don't feel no energy here. Do we gotta just pull the lever? Do we pull at the same time? Oh. Um. 
Oh, okay. That's that's Yeah, that looks about right. <laughs> Oh, nice! Oh! <laughs> Dude! What are you trying to give me a heart attack? That scared the shit out of me! Sorry, I got the gate open for a second, but that switch won't stay on. <laughs> Todd, can you come stand on this? Larry and I can go find Ash while you make sure we don't get locked in. Sure, I can do that. Oh my gosh, he's gonna get killed. <laughs> We're so glad to have you here, Todd. You're great. Doing great, sweetie. <laughs> Ready? No, but Ash is in there somewhere, so let's go. Be safe, you two. I don't want to lose anyone else down here. What? You don't want to lose anyone else down here? Well, you sound kind of sus. Looks like there are two ways. We better split up. I was afraid you were gonna say that. Wait, now I don't trust him, and I don't know why. Are we playing as him? Why do these things always happen to me? Maybe because your mom is in on it? You ever thought of that? Um. Crap, this place is like a maze. Is this how we die? Is there a sequence or like? <laughs> oh, it's lit up now. Something's coming from that hole. What is this? Why does this happen to me? Something's coming from here. Maybe I follow the sound. Oh, okay, here, wait, um, eh? First, second, how would I reach the end? <laughs> Can I just say that was that was just so random? <laughs> I just like walked around mindlessly. <laughs> played that um uh the gas game on on uh, on twitch it was just like gut feeling i was just like huh, huh, huh. and then like psh, i got through for some reason i don't know maybe i'm smarter when i don't think <laughs> oh lord huh okay now it's our turn I think we're supposed to follow the room that's the most quiet. Huh. Big brain. <laughs> First try, I just gotcha. Hmm. 
Yeah. Ah, uh, here we are. <clears throat> An old book with a with a wooden cover. There's a solid black circle carved into the front. It's what what's and that's made from a different type of wood. The frail green pages are covered in painted symbols. I can't make any sense of it, but it leaves a bitter taste in my mouth. All right, here's here's another time for gotcha. This one's harder because now you can come, you can walk behind it. I have a feeling you gotta come to the back to activate one of these. Maybe we get this first. Oh, I was so sure that one was locked in. You gotta go. We gotta be here for a while. Now this one's hard. Because you can walk through here, so you can't clear like, Oh, that's the last one, I don't need to ever press on it anymore. This one needs to go down. Alright. This one needs to go down. Unless we try to get the left side down. And then we focus on the right side. Is that how you do this? God damn it. Now I can't gotcha. Oh wait, hang on. Oh wait, hang on. Oh, it's not coming up anymore. Eh? I wanted to reset it with the far left. Alright, fine. Oh, here we go. Okay. I can't reset it no more. Random genius. I'm trying to think and maybe I shouldn't be thinking. Also, I'm being bit bitten by mosquitoes. I just noticed both choices for Larry and Sandy. Uh, Larry and Sally, the top part of the door is different. Aha! My brain's farting. Yes, yeah, same. Thank you, Hijiri. Thank you so much. How are you today? So if I'm not supposed to clear the right side first, that means I'm supposed to clear the left side first. Yeah, none of these will push the left side down. So I have to come here. In order to... What if I do this? I'm being bitten by so many mosquitoes. Give it up! I have a feeling once you get the left side down, you don't have to deal with it anymore. Okay, that's not gonna work. That one has done that a few times. Right, we don't deal with left side first. Get I'm trying to get this one down. Okay. Oh, nice. Okay. <laughs> da -na, da -na, da -na, da -na. Yeah. So we have to clear the right side first, and then we clear the left side. Okay. Hey, dude. Hey, good timing. I think we have to pull these levers at the same time to open that gate. We must have walked in on a big circle. That room behind the gate is just the center of this place. This is the last room. Ash has to be back there. Let's go! <laughs> I'm in this with you together. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. It says, May our sight pierce the heavens and our reach be infinite and everlasting. Huh? Huh. I think this weird hex thing is from Mr. Packer's desk. It's some kind of key. Whoa. I mean, I did take it. I could have left it, but I took it. What if I didn't take it? Would we still get here? <gasps> oh no. Holy shit balls. Oh my gosh. It's another book pedestal, but this one has nothing on it. <laughs> Girlfriend? Is 
she did. Ah! Oh. Ash! Can you imagine? Ash, are you okay? Ash? Is she... She's still breathing. Come on, help me get her up. She got stabbed by bone, didn't she? Huh? She's awake. Wh what's going on? Wh where are we? Dude, you fell down the stupid trash, dude. I thought we lost you for good. I'm so glad we found you. Are you okay? <gasps> you know what just hit me? Yeah, I think so. Just a little fuzzy and sore. No broken bones. Well, none of mine at least. Hey man, Ash, you wouldn't believe what we went through to find you. It's all thanks to Sally. He had one of his vision thingies and then he found this old cellar door in the basement and then we went down these long creepy stairs and we found this crazy ass cult temple or some shit down here. And then there were all these puzzles and traps and mazes and Todd. Todd is holding the front gate open for us. We should go back there. Well, this is so much taking. I can't believe all of this right below the apartments. You know what just hit me? I'm gonna taste it. Ah! Eat well. Eat well. I'm getting bitten by mosquitoes. You know what just hit me? Is that how many trash shoots are here? Like how many of these tenants are doing this? Thanks for coming for me. I don't know what I'd do without you guys. There was like at least four, right? There was like four four apartments in this four shoots in this apartment that 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 is working. The whole apartments are cultists! Dun dun dun! So what are we gonna do about all of this? Mrs. Packers, Packerton has killed a lot of people and the Bologna. Ugh, we can't just ignore this. Definitely not. Judging by what you guys have told me about the inner rooms of the temple and about Mrs. Packer's apartment, it could be possible that she's gotten herself wrapped up in the occult as well. Even if the congregation has long since dissolved, she could have stumbled upon this door just as we have. Or maybe she's the last remaining member, trying to carry out whatever their plans were on her own. You don't think she's trying to bring the red-eyed demon back, do you? Hopefully not, but we'll be prepared if she does. Man, we need to stop her, preferably like before that happens. Surprised if four of them are still alive. I know, right? I know going to the local police isn't an option. Maybe we should call the state police or the FBI or something. Honestly, I think this would be big enough to involve the FBI. I think this is possibly big enough to involve the FBI, yeah. At least this time, our parents can't deny what's happening. They'll help us once we show them what's below this building and what Packerton has been doing. Ash is right. We should get our parents involved this time. Maybe we should just kill her. What? Mrs. Packerton, maybe we could just kill her. She's old. We can't just kill someone, Larry. There'll be no better than her. Normally, it'll be against har I'll, I'll, I would be against harming others, but in this case, Larry might be right. <gasps> Todd, Larry, seriously, you guys? Think about all of the strange, unexplainable occurrences that happened in Edison's apartment and in Knockfell in general. The more I think about it, the less likely it becomes that Mrs. Packerton is acting alone. She must be getting outside help. It would explain the police cover-ups of Charlie and the Holmes family murders. There's no telling how far this corruption reaches. God damn. I guess that makes sense. Blue eyes, white dragon. What kind of proof you can show them? What if FBI is a part? Do you know what? How big FBI is? <laughs> I mean, I think even if they were to be in a cult, I don't think they'll be in this Edison apartment cult. They'd probably be in like a much much bigger cult that's like full of rich people you know not no tea no shade not gonna drop no names but you know what i'm saying allegedly 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 you know <laughs> yeah i think they would need to see the 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 freezer yeah i think they would need to see the freezer i guess that makes sense Sal, you were saying something similar earlier today too i don't know maybe this does fall on this to be taken care of maybe you know, the biggest worries normal teenagers have are about petty things like being popular and having nice hair. <laughs> Not us, though. We just have to worry about saving the world, I guess. Oh, man. This cult has been around for centuries, apparently. I know, right? The government is in on this, perhaps. Mayhaps. So what happened? We decided to sleep on it. It was nearly morning anyways, and everyone was beyond exhausted. And the teacher? What did you decide? Did you go to the police? Didn't have to. Turns out Packerton got into a car accident on the way home that same night. <gasps> she and the other driver were killed on impact. <sighs> wow, that's quite convenient. You can look it up for yourself if you don't believe me. What happened to the husband's corpse in, in the apartment? What happened to the poop? <sighs> 
It was on the front page the next day. Beloved Knockfell High, High teacher killed by drunk driver. Of course, you won't find anything about the dead bodies in her apartment or how she was feeding the students human flesh. That was all covered up. I see. I don't care if you don't believe me. It's the truth and you said you would air the full story. Don't worry, Sal. It will be aired in full. I always keep my word and I think the people will be very interested in what you have to say. Who are you airing it to? First of all, who are your target audiences? Because I would like to know. Because it might not be in the public eye. You know, it could be in your little cult church. I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah. That's so scary. Everyone's watching you now. You spoke with a great fondness about your friends, Ashley. I understand that you two were very close. You even consider her one of your best friends along with Larry Johnson and Todd Morrison. Is that true? Yes. Have you seen this? The Sally Face Killer. Trial today for mass murder including entire family. Sources say that the prosecutor will call Ashley Campbell to testify against the Sally the Face Killer. Campbell is a longtime friend of Sally, Sally Face, and they were said to be very close in high school. Testify against us? Our girlfriend? I don't trust that face. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> Sus, how many subs do you have? You about to waste my last three hours before my persecution um uh to to rec record this freaking documentary to air to your 20 subscribers <laughs> not even netflix you're not even netflix you're not even gonna make a docuseries on netflix <laughs> am i being mean <laughs> Ashley Campbell, meanwhile, my brain's Ash Ketchum. Ash Ketchum. Gonna catch him, Mom. Oh, he cried. Oh, he's crying. What about Todd? You said you'd tell me about Todd. Oh, right, of course. We shot a segment on Morrison yesterday. He's still in the hospital after what happened that night. What's wrong? Where's it all? What's wrong, boy? Hmm? He doesn't look well. He's so he's so groggy. <laughs> Man, this is sad. Yeah. Come boy. That all? He's just. He's just sitting there. Everybody's getting sick these days, bruh. You okay, boy? What's wrong? You look so emo. Come here. Anyone? Anyone, what's wrong? You okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, boy? Ugh, let me let me let him out to get to eat, to eat food. Maybe he's just hungry. Are you hungry? Interesting. I think he's just hungry. <laughs> yeah, six season perhaps. My throat is dying. There's like a stomach flu going around or something, I think. And then everybody's getting sick. Everybody's getting food poisoning. Everybody's getting sore throat fever. Everybody's coughing as well in public spaces. Yeah. Maybe he's just hungry for Adoni's affection. He was sleeping in my room. Like he he if he finds comfort in in sleeping in my room when I'm here. Anyways, let's continue your story. He's still out of it, unresponsive, still not talking. So we couldn't have a conversation with him. We mostly spoke with his doctor. I'm sorry, Sal. Apparently, Morrison hasn't shown any signs of improvement. In fact, his condition has been getting worse. They say that the damage he suffered from that night is irreversible. He doesn't know from, he doesn't know fantasy from reality and all he wants is to die. No, he's in an asylum. When he is denied the release of death, he becomes extremely violent. I I need to help him somehow. I, I need to help him. 
Even the doctors and trained professionals haven't been able to help Todd. How do you suppose you'll be able to? Because I know the truth. I know what really happened. I know what's wrong with Todd. Is he possessed? Todd is possessed. Oh my god! I knew it! Todd, I will suck you in the fucking face, you bitch boy. Sorry, you were nice, you were nice, you were nice. You're just possessed. <laughs> I hate it. I hate it. I think they got him. Achievement unlocked full of balonies. Mm. Holy sh Geronimo, hi, Kuro. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's ho blood there. Look at all the blood. Oh my gosh. This is how they caught us? No wonder we were sentenced. <laughs> I'm awake. I'm awake already. Good God. Why is the TV above our heads? Why is the TV above our heads? Huh? Eh? Beezlebub, who are you? I am. Lord Beezlebub! Whoa, really? So you're like the devil or something? No, it is a nickname bestowed upon me by my kin. Family can be rough, indeed. Can I get into that door? You've only just arrived. No, you may not pass through my doorway. You must first admire my art. Your art? Yes. In the dark, there are five. The fifth. You mustn't see. One of the remaining four arts, you must gaze upon three. Once you have done so, report back to me. Alright, whatever you say, Edgar, it's Beezlebub. Lord Beezlebub. Okay, bubs. Can you repeat your little rhyme? In the, door, in the dark, there are five. The fifth you mustn't see. Of the remaining four arts, you must gaze upon three. I'm tired as fuck. I'm gonna thank you so much, Big Biggie, for being here. Good night. Good night. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for helping out. Otsu, thank you. Sleep well. Once you've done so, report back to me. Okay. So in the dark, there are five photos. I'm supposed to only look at three. I can't look at the fifth one. Let's go to three. Trapen rot. Hot. It is broken before he found me, scattered and lost. He looked upon my face and sh saw me, saw all of me at once. After being discarded by everyone else, after years of not being seen or heard, he saw me, and we were in love. And everything was perfect until it fell apart again. Now there's only pain. I beg your pardon. Am I supposed to do something about this? Am I supposed to write this down? Where's my pen? <laughs> Good luck with the rest of the- Thank you so much, thank you. Alright. So, I'm supposed to draw this out or something? You know what, I'm not doing a good job. Alright, that's one. Let's go back to the first one, why don't we? Ew. There was a knock at the door and I couldn't and I could see it again. It was me again. Suddenly it forced my hand and this freedom was revealed to be only an illusion. I was forced to watch everything, a prisoner in my own mind. I've done terrible things, unforgivable things. My head hurts. I don't understand. No. I think this says no. What room is this? Number one. Alright. <laughs> Screenshot it? I can't, because I have to crop it. This is the second room. Okay.
You know I found some really good black and white games. <laughs> what have we done to deserve such agony? They were determined to devour us all. Nothing could stop them. The burning lights of the gods have faded. Their watchful eyes turned on, turned to horrified screams, and then everything was black. I'm supposed to gaze upon three. Out of four, it's locked. Huh. First one is this. Second one is the N. Oh no, first one is the N, I'm sorry. Second one is the F. Oh, this one. Third one is the... This one. No? What? Ain't it also control plus print screen? I can't. My uh, my laptop doesn't let me do that. Hello, Hayes. Hello, Aruri Yangter Jante. Hello. All right, it's locked. Maybe I reverse it. Do math with the clue. In the dark, there are five. The fifth you mustn't see. Of the remaining four arts, you must gaze upon three. So three, is it three? Once you have done so, report back to me. Moikai. In the dark, there are five. The fifth you mustn't see. Okay. Of the remaining four arts, you must gaze upon three. I only have three arts. Once you've done so, I'm too dumb for this. So... The third one was the top and rot, right? They're heartbroken. Their sins, they're in a lot of pain. As they're filled with regret and sorrow. I don't get it. My brain is lagging. Yeah, it doesn't change. Maybe I just shuffle it. Let's do one, three, two. Let's do two, one, three. Bukan si. Ah, Oh, oh, oh. Really? How do I count the bihua? What? What's the new convo just now. How do you correlate they correlate that with symbol? When you close through that door, there's no going back. Thank you. Huh? You're welcome. You see above? What? Did I? I didn't. Nani? Maybe I'll come back here later? Bi hua. Bi er san si wu. Liu qi ba. That's eight. Bi er san si wu. Liu qi. Seven. Bi er san si wu. Liu. That's six. But it's not numbers. But he said no coming back. I know, right? So what if I want to solve this? Okay, so let me tell you what's going on. The first room has the N. This N. Um, the first room has this. The second room has this. And then an F next to it. The third room has this. The thunder. 
Is it not? We could keep trying all the combinations. The dots means zero. Zero? Oh, what? Uh, uh, san, si, fu. So, what is the clue? He said gaze upon. Okay, there are five photos. Uh, gaze upon f three. Wait, you cannot see the fifth photo. You cannot see the fifth photo. There are. F Wait, what? You can't see the fifth photo. There are four, but out of the four, you need to look at three. Right? Right? Hack. One, two, three. It says you can't, you shouldn't look at the fifth one. Sounds so, oh, that's five. Am I doing this wrong? <laughs> this is four. So, oh. Should we just Google it? <laughs> Let's just Google it. Maybe it'll explain it to me. I'm getting c -c 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 confused. Sally face, Bezel, Bub code. Explanation. Okay. Let's see. Oh, okay. Try to enter door four, but it's locked. You need to figure out the combination. Now, this is tricky. It's not just a case of copying the symbols from each room. You have to really think outside of the box. It involves counting the lines in each of the symbols. To make things easier, just set the code to this. Diamond shaped. That's eight. Eight. Bow shaped e six Diamond with a Y E That's seven. Eight six seven Looking at the two symbols, door one to three, the symbols can be converted into numbers by looking at the numbers of lines in each same symbol. The same for symbols on the door, they're numbered one to eight. Oh, okay. So this, okay, I'll explain. This symbol, if you count how many strokes to make this, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you write down seven. Okay, this is door number one. Here, this is... Oh, wrong. I don't want to talk to you. So we have seven there. For this, it is one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's six. And then in the other room, we would have eight. Then we have seven, six, eight. The door with one left digit of door two, you get the answer of door. Oh, okay. Numbers 53, 33, and 42, you add the left number to the right digit. Whoa, my god. Door, oh my god. That's a bit much. Mm. 3, 4, 2, 6, nine, 7. I'm just gonna not keep this pen. Now, which monster is here? Because we need to talk to. 
We can't look at the monster on the fifth room. Oh. Her soul was corrupted by dark, by hunger, by isolation. She suffered greatly. Through our union, we have saved her. We are the endless echoes within oblivion. We are all that is, was, and will never be. Hunting ghosts or solving the Big Bang Theory? Oh! Nope. That's a no, because we're not allowed to look at the fifth room. Okay, but like, I'm curious. <laughs> okay, but like, I'm curious. So. Okay, just one more time. Alright, alright, alright. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Calm yourself. Spill my tea, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, we're in the sixth room. Stars. Turn on. Oh. What on earth? Okay, lost. Uh, hello? Is anyone listening? Is anyone there? Please, I need help. I can't remember who I am. It's so dark here. I remember a bl Ooh, I'm blinded by the light. Sorry. I can even hear meow. Yeah, my cat is meowing. <laughs> Sound like my sister's room, Nanny? <laughs> Hello? Then a burning pain washed over me, then I was here. I can't shake this feeling of loss and despair. Am I dead? I don't know. What am I supposed to do here? Okay, so... Is that the same combo again? Hello, is anyone listening? Yeah, 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 yeah. Exit. Oh, we grown up now. It's a VTuber, bruh. We have pills and we have different masks. Charger. Where's my cell phone? I don't know. Do you guys call it cell phones? Is that Wednesday Adams? Probably not. I think it is though. Yo, look at our place! On our very local mystery. In other news, Knockfell Mills was engulfed in flames this morning. Oh no, the school. Firefighters rushed to the scene by the time they were, but by the time they were able to eliminate fire, a majority of building and materials had already been destroyed. My god. The factory has been a major source of employment for our small town since 1934. This is the third time the building has caught fire, though never have we seen such devastation as today. The authorities believe the fire to be a result of foul play and couldn't say anything anymore at this time. Earlier this year was also the anniversary of the previous fire, the second largest of the three, where over 20 people died! Luckily this time there were no casualties, however three factories workers are, are currently in the hospital with minor injuries. Currently it is unclear as to whether the owners can afford to rebuild the mill. They have been on a slow decline for the past decade and have been struggling financially. If they don't rebuild, many families will lose their main source of income. We will keep you updated as we receive more details. No more twin tail? Yeah, I think it grew up to be a little more edgy. Which episode is this again? I think there are at 10 episodes, right? Yeah. Hey, Irie, did you enjoy the soccer? Are you on the wrong stream? <laughs> My name is Adity. Wait, wait, wait. Is Gwyn streaming? Maybe Gwyn streaming. Irie Guinevere. Or maybe Ari Irie Cordelia. Yeah, it's fine. I do this often. <laughs> oh, there's a cat door. I wonder if our fat cat can fit through it. <laughs> Teen Sally. Yeah. Five episodes? Ah. Uh. Hmm. Maybe there are... Oh, we have a basement now, apparently. Gizmo. Gizmo always leaves one piece of poop in his freaking litter box. 
<laughs> I love him. Typo. No, it's fine. But did you tweet? You did tweet about soccer. That is true. Uh, I didn't really catch it. I I didn't really understand what I was doing. <gasps> no way. Is that cinnamon toast can? That's PewDiePie on the wall. Eh? That's cinnamon toast can, right? Isn't it? Yeah. Hey yo. Ah. Gizmo got his own room. Giz this is Gizmo's man cave. It's his own little pad. Hey Gizmo. Dude, really? Why do you keep getting these stickers? <laughs> based. He's so based. Exit. Whoa, where do we live now? We upgraded, huh? Shed, we just updated the lock. I'm not sure what Todd set the new code to. Alright. Oh, we've moved in together. Like all of us, the buddies. Easter egg, yeah. Kise, hello! Good luck, have fun, thank you! Thank you so much. The cat can talk like a human. I know, hi, Sama! So she did celebrate as Hari Raya. Who? Who did? Hold on, let me... Okay, I put my phone away. Sal's room? Which room? What is this? Uh, storage, maybe? Oh, I didn't mean to click out, sorry. Alright. I don't have my Game Boy thing no more. There's an upstairs. Where the hell do we live? Oh, that's to go outside. Bro, this is an upgrade. Hello? Blue hair? Hmm. Hey, Neil, you are Todd's boyfriend. Morning, Salia. What's up? What's happening? Hey, Neil. No pigtails today, huh? I don't think I've ever seen you with your hair down. I almost didn't recognize you. <laughs> yeah. You feeling alright, man? You seem out of it. Um, yeah, I'm alright. Have you been sleeping okay? I heard you got up a few times last night. Got a fresh pot of coffee downstairs. I know you're not a big fan, but you should have a cup. It'll do you good. I never start the day without my caffeine to fix. Thanks. I guess I'm feeling a little tired. Not a problem, Salio. Have you seen my cell phone? I can't find it anywhere. Oh yeah, I found it outside last night on the porch. I didn't want to leave it there, so I brought it in. I've almost forgot I had it. Thanks, I didn't recognize I left it outside. No worries. Happened to the best of us. Here you go, man. Where's Todd? He has classes this morning. Oh, right. How does the ghost hunting... Um, how goes the ghost hunting? Todd was saying it's been pretty slow lately on that front. Slow? I wish, uh, yeah. It's slow. It's been slow. You boys are trying to keep me protected again, huh? It's sweet, but you know I can handle myself, right? Plus, I'm two years older than y'all, too. No, I know, it's just that we... Yeah, yeah, four friends. Made a pack five years ago, and I can respect the loyalty behind that. Actually, I think it's pretty damn cute. <laughs> He's feeling the FOMO! Let him in! Heh. <laughs> Speaking of cute, I heard the lovely Ash was coming to town today. The lone wolf of the four horsemen returns. Are you excited? We're supposed to catch up this afternoon. So that's a no on the excitement, then. No, I can't wait to see her. I'm just, you know, feeling tired today. There's still coffee downstairs calling your name. Sally Face, come get some! Did you hear the strange noises? Uh, you're gonna have to be a little more specific, Mr. Sleepyhead. Last night I thought I heard something like a weird siren. I didn't hear anything like that. Maybe Gizmo was up watching TV. <laughs> they act so chill about the freaking cat watching TV. I don't, do you have a pet? Yes, I do. I have a cat. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, here you go. <laughs> Hashtag bring back the twin tail. Yeah. The cat's too OP. No, it wasn't that. It was just kind of like, uh, eh, never mind. Probably just the nightmares. Gosh, man, are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm good. How was going? How's work going? Oh, shit, work. I'm supposed to cover the morning shift today. Gotta run, say later. Catch you later. Okay. Nothing. It's cute. Cute. We are flatmates. But I do have my phone now. Maybe I charge it. I'll 
check back in a minute. Wait, what? Oh, I just put my phone away. Cool, 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 cool. <laughs> I want to go suck that cat's tummy. It's so bright outside. Yeah, go. Alright, maybe it's time we find a code for the shed. What could the code be? No clues here. Ah, there's a note from Todd to me. Cute. Ah, here we go. Here's the new code. And we better write this down. Okay. Okay. Nice. They have a photo of this of them on the on the table. That's so cute. Yeah. Lucha Bangan. I just realized you're holding a cat. Yeah, it's my cat. His name is Jado. He was here earlier. He meowed. You guys must have heard him, right? <laughs> Gave me one holding her baby. Yeah. I'm holding my baby. Oh, this is the toilet. Anything we can do here? It's so pink. I love it. Basement. Oh, we go out from the basement. Do we live upstairs or what? <laughs> Kill. I got I got some seeds in my mouthy. Cinnamon paint bathroom. If it's like Sanrio, I would die. So cute. Four. Zero. Three. Five. Six. Four. Enter. Eh? Okay, you know what? Four, zero, three, five. Oh, three, six, four. Let's go! Has Zero gotten any clothing before? I put him in some clothes and he never liked it. He was like, nah! <laughs> <laughs> Bored Can't believe we've been working on this for 5 years now It feels like the more connections we find The lesser sen less sense it all makes Stuff Is the cult still operating? If so, where then where are they all? Workstation It was cool of Rob to give us some funds for the new equipment When he found out what we were up to He basically thought we were real life ghost nabbers Oh, huh? what's this loose tape? Ah! Phantom. I saw the faded shape of a man. There's something important about him. I can feel it like a distant memory itching at the back of my skull. His image is fleeting. It flickers in and out of view. It's as if he's trapped in a parallel reality. A phantom, just out of reach. Or perhaps I am the phantom and he resides in the land of the living? I've cried for his attention, but I don't think that he can ever see or hear me. There are so many that I have to find. There are nine tapes. Nine reasons why. Instead of 13 reasons why, there's nine reasons why. By the way, um, I love that show. It was just so heavy. Sometimes it was too heavy for me. Ilya, hello! Where are the rest of the tapes? I know, right? We have to find it. I think we have to find it. We have to find it. And I don't have my Game Boy thing. So, yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Glitik por jero. He... I think he lost a little bit of weight. But I'm pretty sure he's still 10 kilograms. Hello? <laughs> Let's go upstairs. Can we leave this place? Maybe we should go check our phones then. Cause we gotta we gotta go meet our girlfriend. Looks like he's charged now. There's a new message from Larry. Use. Are you awake? Am now WhatsApp. Send. Something is wrong with medicine apart 
apartment. Other than ghosts and creepy basement. I'm serious. I'm coming over. Give me a few minutes. Okay, text me when you're ready. Ready. On the way now. What about our girlfriend? What about Sally? No, Sally's us. What about her? Uh, uh, Abby, what's her face? Um, uh, I forgot her name. Episode 4, The Trial. Ash, right, Ash. I miss retro flip phone. Yeah, me too. This all seems to be a dramatic change from your original story, Mr. Fisher. I forgot <laughs> I forgot our girlfriend's name. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's episode four. I think in total there are ten, right? I better Google this real quick. Abby Cell, are you cheating on me? <gasps> dun dun dun. Let me see. How many episodes in Sally Face? Because I bought the whole bundle, so I got every episode. There are five episodes. In total. Okay. Okay. On the way in game, like three minutes. Me in real life on the way takes three hours. Yeah. I don't need the best lover. Forgets lover's name when gone for more than five minutes. <laughs> Listen, uh, you gotta leave an impression. <laughs> Plus, I call her baby. I'm just kidding. <laughs> when you call somebody their nickname too much, you kind of forget their real name ever. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I didn't know what I just <laughs> Look at this guy with the purple hair. <laughs> He's balding in the back. <laughs> what is he? bald spot in the back of his head <laughs> the artists are so extra <laughs> they really <laughs> don't laugh at him <laughs> they didn't have to do anybody dirty like this they didn't have to make anybody like this they could have given him a whole head of hair but no <laughs> They said, they said, oh no, <laughs> let's give him, <coughs> oh god, they said, let's give him a bald patch behind his head. <laughs> I'm crying, I'm crying. I won't be sleeping <laughs> thinking about his hair. Why did they did him dirty like this? <sighs> they did him dirty. <laughs> they did him so dirty. <laughs> I feel so bad. Bald patch from all the stress from being a lawyer. <laughs> I know, right? Wait, what if he's not lawyer? What if he's like the victim or something? <laughs> Need something to break the seriousness in the game. <laughs> it adds flavor. No, seriously, they didn't have to do that. My goodness. So extra. <laughs> Isn't it true you, you had initially stated that you weren't in contact with Larry Johnson? <laughs> <clears throat> yes. So, oh, he is the prosecutor. Oh God. So you admit to lying in your original state. <laughs> you know, you know what his thought process is. You you can't. Okay, when you look in the mirror, you don't really know what's going on behind your head, right? So to yourself, you probably think you look good from the back. So he probably thinks that he covered up the bald spot and nobody could ever see it from the back. He, he probably thought it was good or he probably never even noticed that he was balding from the back of his head <laughs> But everybody else sitting behind him could see it in every single case court case His eyebrows are thick. <laughs> Hi cloud. Yeah, his eyebrows are thick He's got a strong personality. I guess <clears throat> Oh my gosh, I need to calm down. So you admit to lying in your original statements <laughs> Yes, I was in shock from what happened and thought that the truth would be more harmful. That no one would believe me. I didn't know what else to do. And how can we trust anything you say now? How are we to decipher what is true and what is a lie? All I have left is the truth. It's important that the people hear what I have to say, whether they believe it or not. Well, I hope for their sake that they do. 
strong personality to cover up his bald spot. I think everybody around him has been overly polite and ha 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 has been uh, hiding it from him. <laughs> has just been keeping it from him. Because you don't go up to somebody, you don't tap their shoulder and be like, Hey sir, you're balding from the back. <laughs> Maybe ignorance is bliss. Maybe it's best if he never found out. Otherwise, his confidence would have taken a toll. I feel like. I feel like. I feel like. Thank you, Warehouse Rat. Have a nice evening. Thank you. You too. You too. <clears throat> Thank you for coming. Yeah, have a great um, public holiday. <clears throat> Let me drink some... Let me drink some water. Let me drink some juice. Oh, God. Oh, that was funny. Is that a threat? It's a warning. Would you have us believe that there's still a killer on the loose in Knockfell? That all the evidence presented today, the victim's blood on your clothes and your skin and your fingerprints on the murder weapon, the security footage, the eyewitness accounts, and all of the things that were so all of those things were some elaborate cover-up created by who? The county police department? I think they're trying to not get him to plead uh, insanity because he's talking about ghosts now, right? And demons and whatnot, so he could be like trying to plead insanity. Take care, yeah, take care, Russ Bald Spot. Sir, I think you might be missing some hair. <coughs> Jesus Christ. If it's alright with the court, I'd like to continue my testimony. It's important that the story to be told chron chronologically. In order to prevent details from being taken out of context, well, more so than they have already been. <laughs> Why does he look like this? <laughs> and he has blush on. <laughs> he's cute. Yeah, he's cute. <laughs> He is cute. Yeah, I would I would not I would I would not deny that. <laughs> Stewie, is that you? Whip cream. Whip cream. A woo? <sighs> I'll allow it. Please continue with your testimony, Mr. Fisher. But realize we will expect answer to these questions the prosecutor but prosecution the prosecution has presented. <clears throat> Everything will be answered. Then proceed. Well, this is this is chapter four, right? I'm telling you, dude, something is seriously wrong. Did you see the demon again? No, I haven't seen it since we blasted it years ago. I even went through every inch of the building this morning with the super gear boy and found nothing. All the ghosts have been missing for weeks. <clears throat> That's a little odd. Though who's to say it's a bad thing? Maybe they were able to finally pass on. I don't know, man. I've been getting this horrible feeling. Like something under my skin crawling around, itching at the back of my skull. It's like the quiet before the storm or some shit. I can feel it. Huh. What? Deja vu. I've been getting that feeling too. Like everything is foggy and there's something there. Just beyond the fog. Just waiting. Yeah, exactly. Whatever it is, is coming from the apartments. So are you gonna come check it out or what? Of course I will. <clears throat> Should we get Todd? He has class today. Oh, alright. I was hoping he'd had a new gadget or something. He's been working on something, but I don't think it's finished yet. The guitar mods are finally done, but Todd hasn't shown me how to use it yet, so best not to mess with it. Guitar mods? Is that why they found him like holding his guitar in front of all the blood and stuff? Hopefully it works better than... Uh yeah, I like to keep my guitar in one piece. <coughs> Excuse me. The dialogues are moving on its own. So are you all packed up? Almost. I want to get the rest moved over this weekend. It'd be nice to finally get out of that basement. <laughs> yeah, the the I'm not pressing anything. It's just going by itself. Cool. Toss it. We can use the. Oh my god, sweet. Yeah. The the dialogues have been moving by itself. It used to not be like this. I used to be able to press next, but now it's just moving on its own. <clears throat> hey Arnold, his hairline though, I know it's cute. The plot will explain it all later. Aha. Uh -huh. 
Is that roadkill? That's roadkill, right? <clears throat> Knockfell Homes. Affordable homes in a beautiful hillside district. Call 555 home to view today. Hey, Sal. Yeah? What if everything is too broken to fix? Like, why are we the only ones doing anything about any of this? I think everyone else just chooses to ignore the fact that everything is so broken, you know? How can they? I don't get it. How are other people so happy? Why can't we be like that? Maybe it's because we actually give a shit, or maybe it's because we can't ignore how messed up things are around here. <clears throat> I guess... I don't know, dude. Damn. Here's the cemetery. Can we go in? No. <coughs> Excuse me. Phelps Ministry. God sees all. That is real cute, right? Stop being sus for on class every day. Hello? <coughs> Maybe because you're too, you're the broken dun dun dun. I'm already full from before the main burger. Oh no, Addison Apartments. Looks like you were right about that storm. <clears throat> All right, let's do this. Right behind you. So we are supposed to search the apartment, but I wonder what we would find. Oh, two of these are sealed up now. Mr. Addison's been storing this stuff here in here so long. I bet he doesn't even remember what's in all of these boxes. They're probably filled with stuff from when his family was alive. Yeah, some of them are. The rest is like old clothes, old tea sets, cookbooks, just a bunch of old junk. Larry, what? You snoop through Terrence's thing? <laughs> well, yeah, dude, how could I not? The guy never leaves his room. Plus, I also wanted to make sure he wasn't involved with the cult or hiding bodies in here or anything weird. But it's all just normal, boring, old man stuff. <clears throat> okay, fair enough, I guess. That's still so bad. Huh. Larry, I know, right? Larry is so sus, but like, I, I'm rooting for him. <laughs> well, good evening, young sirs. How are you two doing this fine day? We're doing okay. How about you? I'm just wonderful. Things have been so peaceful in the building. Though, of course, we do miss having our dear Sal Fisher with us, and I'll be sad to see Larry going as well. I'll miss it here too, but it'd be nice to get out of that basement. Plus, we're only right down the road. <coughs> I understand. Our young lads are all grown up now and ready for the next stage of their lives. Thank you for the mod. <coughs> I'm excited for you both, you know. I wish you boys nothing but the best. You truly deserve it. Thanks. <coughs> Thank you, Terrence. Excuse me. My throat is dying. <coughs> Miss Rosenberg's place. Is she still alive? Aww. Why did they leave all of Rosenberg's stuff in here again? Addison still thinks she's on vacation or something that she'll come back. I don't think that's gonna happen. Oh shit. What is that? A piece of tooth? Huh. What is it? It's a tooth. Gross dude, you picked it up with your bare hand? And now I'm just gonna leave it here. What if we need it for something? What could we possibly need someone's tooth for? Hi, I'm Sally Face, and this is my friend Larry. We research paranormal and occult activities in the town of Knockville, where everything weird can and does happen. <clears throat> Good point. It says E. <gasps> two, two out of five? Hope you can try it soon, Hijiri. How was the blueberry burger, Aruri? I rate it five and a half out of ten. It's a meh. It's a meh burger. Sally to the Tooth Fairy. We could get some like 50 cents back, maybe. How many tooth do we have to find? <laughs> Old chair. I'm still not really sure what happened to her. You said she just like disappeared, right? Yeah, but it was more than that. She appeared as a ghost before vanishing. I don't think she was fully human. Oh, right. I remember you saying that. And she was in the cult for a while, but then stopped them. Or tried to stop them, which would have made her super old. I think she was a demon. I think she was a witch. I think she was an alien. I think she was a witch. Well, that would make more sense, though. If she had any powers, why would Rosenberg just mope around this little apartment? Maybe she was too old or maybe she had just given up. If I had powers, I would never retire. I'd be getting in all kinds of s trouble. Yeah, I know you would. She knew something. 
Yeah, she just didn't tell us. <coughs> Alien, a witch. I think she was a witch. Also, why does teeth have some sort of marking on it? Yeah, it has like E. It says E. E. <coughs> Mrs. Gibson's place. Is she still old and wrinkly? <laughs> yeah, what do you want, Sal? Ugh, what is he here? Hey, Mrs. Gibson, we were... What's about... Well, that's about par for the course. That lady sure can hold a grudge. <coughs> She's like, ew. Well, we'll search the basement later. <coughs> E-sports. This is Todd's... Hello, you are high as a kite, lady. Sally Face and Larry Bear, this is a pleasant surprise. Hi, Janice. Hey, what brings you two here? <laughs> Just say hi. Hello, hee hee. Uh, hello, hi. Okay. Do these boys go to the bathroom together? Hee <laughs> hee. Did those boys go into the bathroom together? Hee <laughs> hee. Oh my god. Greg, are you here? Hello? Not getting anything on a super gear boy either. <laughs> Look at the toilet. I've been trying to tell you guys that it's nasty. What is this? What did I just get? Another tooth? Yeah, maybe it's a clue or something. I just got another tooth. Ew, it's black. It's all burned up. E. <coughs> so we're looking for teeth. We have two and we need three more. <coughs> Where's the dad? Oh my god! Hello, Ray. Hey guys, Larry, are you back for more already? Larry? Nah, I'm cool, Ray, thanks. Hey, Mr. Morrison. So, have you seen the garden yet? What do you think? <coughs> it's great, isn't it? Though, it's a thing of true beauty. How did you get all of this stuff anyway? Well, if I told you that, I have to kill you, ha. Huh? Heh. <coughs> but really, this isn't le exactly legal per se, so I appreciate you guys keeping this our little secret. Oh my god. And of course, I'd be happy to supply you with some products whenever you... <laughs> with some produce. Your secret is safe with us. You don't have to worry about that. I don't think so, but you can never be too safe. I know Todd isn't super fun of fond of the fact that we turned this old bedroom into a garden, but he knows how happy it makes us. <clears throat> he also knows that nothing will fill the Todd-shaped hole in our hearts. Ah, he's lucky to have such lucky loving parents and such good friends. I'm damn proud of you boys. Damn proud. <coughs> I mean, these kids are probably so desensitized with whatever that they've seen. They're just like, eh. oh, we are back here. Ugh, man, it still reeks in here. Yeah, it does. Alright, we'll go to the bedrooms in a bit. Boy, oh boy. Oh god, I can't. There's nothing here. <coughs> Getting any readings on a gear boy here? Nope, even your little goat buddy is hiding. If they're hiding, that means, that means the big boy is here. <clears throat> Todd shaped hole that sounds sus to me. I beg your pardon. Devil's lettuce. That was the devil's lettuce. Good looking garden. <laughs> Bruh. Sudden scary BGM. I know. It's time for me to turn in for the night. Thank you for the stream, Adudi. Have fun watching the game, y'all. Thank you, Sharon, for dropping by. I hope you have a wonderful night. Yes, and sleep well. Life support equipment. I wonder what it did to Mr. Packerton's body. Well, at least he wasn't served as lunch meat. Yeah, hopefully not. Oh, God. Huh, there's a tear in the carpet here. I can't pull it by hand, though. Use the tooth. Alright, maybe we find something and we come back here? <coughs> oh, God. Machine. I should have known those guys weren't real cops. I had a feeling about them. I don't know, they cleared this place out overnight, just the two of them. They were definitely the same dudes pretending to be cops when Mr. Sanderson died, too. I saw them leaving in the morning. 
I saw them too, remember? <clears throat> yeah, maybe that's why they came overnight because they knew we'd recognize them somehow. Todd still haven't been able to figure out their true identities, huh? No, but I could have sworn I saw one of them going to a church a few weeks ago. I've been keeping an eye out every day now. They've been having a lot of meetings over there. That's like a normal church thing though. Meetings and whatnot could be nothing or it could be something. That church did always give me the creeps. We went up to Chapel Hill a few times for holidays when I was younger. I've been talking to Todd about setting up some hidden cameras and audio recorders, recorders up there just to check it out. <clears throat> My throat is dying for some reason. Hello? Cool, I'm down for some soft B plus E. B plus E, breaking and end entering. Come on, dude. <laughs> yeah, well, he's the lockpick guy. All right. <clears throat> Nothing in here? I guess maybe we'll come back here later. With some equipment. <clears throat> Time to hydrate. <clears throat> I wonder if it's because I've been staying up for so long. Is this the otaku room? I think this is. Anything here? Huh? A pocket knife. Score. That could come in handy. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, okay. Since we have a pocket knife now, I think we can go back and rip, rip the carpet up. <coughs> let's see, let's see if that's the right tool. If it is, then we can clear this level quickly. And swiftly. You can hear the water. Is this mortuary assistant? <laughs> the corpse furnace? <clears throat> oh this is it oh um i what was the password eh. huh what do you think the password is guys let me in he's uh asking my dad for massages he wants butt pads Needy boy Maybe the tooth is the password We only have It says E though I mean we can come back How about that <clears throat> We can come back Let's collect all of the tooth first All the teeth Okay we were just here <laughs> the master of the doll has spoken. Meow. Did you see on the news that they said Charlie was going to be released? I did, but that's not the real Charlie. Where do you think he is now, the real Charlie, I mean? Most likely the cult has him or killed him. Maybe he ended up in the Bologna. Ugh. As much as I didn't get along with that dude, no one deserved to be made into Bologna. Charlie was a little strange, but he was a good guy. I was starting to like him before we thought he was a murderer. Man, we kind of screwed him over, didn't we? It wasn't our fault, we couldn't, we couldn't have known, and you saw him kill her with your own eyes. I still have nightmares about that. What? It was an imposter? Nothing here. So weird how some of them has one bedroom, some of them has more bedrooms. Like, in the same style of apartment. It was, it's so weird. Alright, there's nothing here. Let's go up to the third floor. Zero, 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 zero. <clears throat> we can try all of that later. Hey, Sal. Hey, Larry. What, what ya ends up to? Hey, David. We're just checking in with everyone. How are things going? Awesome. <clears throat> That's awfully kind of you, but I'm afraid I can't talk much at the moment. Sarah isn't feeling wolf, yesy, so I gotta take care of her. Sorry to hear that. Hope she gets well soon. We'll be around if you need anything. Thank yous. Thank yous both. I still never knew what accent that is. <laughs> 69 think that would be my password. Well, now we all know. 
Hey dude, what's up guys? Yo, hey CJ, are you having a party tonight or something? No, but Z and Sierra are coming over later, just like the old times. You two should stop by if you can. Sounds cool, we we'll keep that in mind. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Alright. Nothing over on this side. I don't remember what happened here on the third floor. My bank account! <laughs> Doing child question mark? I guess I have to deposit all my money into Aruri's bank so I'm saying, hey, no! Hey guys! Oh! <laughs> they got married! How cute! Or I guess they're a thing now. That's cute. Look, they even have a Google Google Eye baby. Oh, hey guys. Hi, Sal. Uh, hey, Larry. Sal, we find. So we face. Sal, we face. Oh, hey. Hey, guys. Yo, okay. You two look like you're up to no good as usual. Glad to see things are stay the same. Oh, are you guys working on another one of your secret cases? It wouldn't be a secret if we told you now, would it? I suppose not. How are you two? We're good, you know, ups and downs, mostly good enough. Yeah, what have you been, Sal? Where have you been? How have you been? Haven't seen you around in a little while. I've been okay, keeping busy with school and whatnot. So, Chug, I heard that your parents moved out. They left a few months ago, too crowded in here with all of us. Plus, they wanted to give us privacy. It's been nice. That was so nice of them to give you guys the apartment. That reminds me, I'm supposed to go visit my parents tonight. Are you okay to watch Soda while I'm gone, babe? Of course! Notice anything weird? No, it's been nice and ghost-free. No spooky stuff for us. Let's hope it stays that way. Alright, see ya. Baby! Hey, Soda! How's my best baby going? doing? Ehehehe. <laughs> Wanna go for a ride on Uncle Sal's shoulders? Oh Sal, she has a bit of a rash right now. You might not want to pick her up. Thanks for the heads up. Mommy? Yes, love? I want to wait on Uncle Sal's shoulders. Not today, Muffin, okay? Remember what I said this morning? Okay. Oh, don't worry, little soul. <clears throat> if you take the medicine you got from the doctor this morning, we'll have you flying around in no time. He <laughs> promise? I promise. You bet. <laughs> Guess what pop oh okay. Bad. This kid ripped the head off a Barbie doll. I am running away from this child. Soda sparkle cute baby. Cute baby. Cute little baby. You chi They I don't even know, it's like gender neutral. They ripped the freaking head off a Barbie doll. Goodbye. This doll is threatened. I'm leaving. You're a dangerous child. My cat is meowing. Oh! Door is open! Your cousin, your doll cousin, rest in peace. <coughs> Excuse me. Something sus here. Another tooth. The tooth will set you free. <laughs> Dude, no. S. Okay. Nothing? Nothing. Let's go. Why would the door be open though? It's kind of sus. I hear the calls of Jedi. Yeah. Let's go up. <clears throat> I think we lived in the fourth floor, right? We haven't gone to the fifth floor in a hot minute. Alright, Dad and Lisa. Who's Lisa? Hello? Oh, that's cute. Hey, Dad. Hey, Lisa. Hi, guys. Hi, fellas. <clears throat> Yo, hey, wait. Is Lisa the janitor? Is she are they with it? What? Ah, not that good. Hello. What? Isn't she the janitor? Yo, hey, when's the last time we had an entire family together like this? Uh, like a couple of weeks ago? Hee <laughs> hee, Sal. We should all have dinner together tonight. Come on, what do you say? What do you say, boys? Lisa is gonna show me the secrets to making her lasagna. Hmm, your lasagna is the best, Lisa. Ah, oh, thank you, sweetie. I'm not gonna say no to free dinner. Actually, I have plans tonight, but I'm, if I'm done early, I'll come over. Okay, we'll have Larry instant message you or whatever you kids do once dinner is ready. It's called texting, Dad. 
right, right, that. Sounds good. <laughs> Larry's mom, right? That's Larry's mom, no? It's kind of cute, they're family. Like family, family. Okay, our toilet is freaking yellow too for some damn reason. People just can't freaking clean their toilet bowls. <laughs> Nasty. That's office. Okay, nothing here. That and Lisa's room? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Hmm. Alright, there's nothing here. Okay. Who's here? Who lives here again? Who's our neighbor? Yeah. <clears throat> Brother in law? Robert? Hey, hey, there's my ghost neighbors. Hey, dude. Hey, Rob. How goes the hunting? It's top secret. Sally, my man, I'm an investor. You can't share even a little detail with me? Actually, we're looking into something right now. That's why we're here. Have you seen anything strange lately? Anything at all? Well, I got this weird rash on my left foot. If you guys could take a whiff and let me know what you... <laughs> I don't think we're really qualified for that. I'm just fucking with you. My, teeth, my feet are fine. If they're so fine, why don't you marry them? <laughs> Larry, you, you fucking nutter. Alright. Keep me posted, fellas. I wanted to ask if he had... If anything... <laughs> I think it's becoming that we can only like ask one question and then we can't like ask all of it. Good <laughs> God of Larry. Larry is such a sassy ass. He's always been sassy like since young, you know? Oh Lord. I hate this music. Oh, Mr. Sanderson? Oh, sorry, we didn't realize anyone was in here. Mr. Sanderson? Hi, Larry. I was just saying goodbye to Sandy. Saying goodbye? I'm leaving Knockfield tonight. I just I just need to leave this place. It's understandable, man. You've been through a lot. Have you... This may sound odd, but have you... Have either of you seen my wife around? I don't know if you believe in ghosts. I guess I was just hoping I could speak to her once more. <sighs> Let's decide. Have we? Have we? I mean, it's so hard. It's so hard. Like, what can we do for her, for him? Even if we can't, even if we do, they did see her before. Like, what if we gave him hope that we could, that he could see her again? But then, like, she doesn't show up because they're all hiding right now. The girl in the tapes. I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> Wasn't she the one that's murdered or something? Like the first day we moved in. Right? 50-50. He's an adult, so we have to give him a reality check. He doesn't, what he doesn't know don't, doesn't hurt him. It's not. It's not the lady in the... It's not the lady in the tapes. I don't know. I just remembered when we first moved in, first day, there was a murder in this house. Right? Yeah, there was a murder happening. It happened in this, and there were the guard, the police were being such a sassy ass. I don't know. Well, 62% of the people are voting yes. Hmm. Have we seen her? We haven't seen her. Have we seen her? Oh, this is so hard. Yeah, but who? This guy's wife. Here's the thing. I think it's more like, can we... Do we want to tell him that we can see this or not? He looks disrupt. I don't... He looks distraught. I don't think he's a part of the cult. So, I mean, if we can, maybe it's a good thing for us to let him say his goodbyes. I don't know. Because he did get robbed of saying goodbye, you know? Because she did get murdered. This is so hard. That's what she said. Hey, he he. She did get murdered, so he couldn't have said his goodbye. 
like he, that was robbed from him you know so man that's that's tough that's hard and that's what she said hmm <laughs> All right, the poll has been decided. Fifty-nine percent of you guys chose no. Sixty-one percent of you guys chose no. Where's my dice at? <laughs> Let me stretch for a little bit. <sighs> nyan, nyan, nyan. All right, I'm ending the poll. Okay. So, 61% said no. So, we haven't seen her. Right, well, perhaps she's in a better place now. I just hope that she is. Sandy didn't deserve this. Oh, God. Would you boys do me a favor and just give me a moment alone here? Sure, Mr. Sanderson, that's no problem. Let us know if you need anything. Thank you, Larry. Aww. Achievement unlocked. Catching up. That's so fucked. Look at the door. All broken. They didn't even fix it and all. <sighs> Guess we haven't seen her. This chapter is about to be more bloody than most. Oh, okay. Thank you. Gore, gore, gore. Oh, lord. What is with all this piss, piss-filled carpets and stuff? There's a tape here, but it's broken. Okay. I guess someone ripped off that CCTV and uh, threw it in there. <coughs> Looks like a gun. No, it was the CCTV outside. Let's go to the fifth floor. This floor is currently being renovated for your safety. Please make your way to the nearest exit. Ah, oh, the birdcage. Looks like there's a hidden panel on the bottom of the birdcage. I never noticed it before. That's weird. There's a loose screw on it. Almost like someone had tried to open it. I'll need a screwdriver or something to open this. And is that a tooth? There's something next to it. <laughs> screwdriver? Where would I find a screwdriver? I'm surprised they're still living in this apartment. I know, right? I guess maybe it's cheap. And maybe rent is cheap. That's why. Yeah. Can we just screw the tape? Holy shit, Pickle. You've made a mistake. What the hell, man? The end will be us all. What does that even mean? You can't be staying in here. The darkness binds. And he gone. Dude, scared the shit out of me. I've caught that bum sleeping up here before, too. I wonder what he meant. It just sounded like crazy gibberish to me, man. There's a tooth here. You want a tooth? You can't handle the tooth. <laughs> w. W. Alright. What if I use a pocket knife to try and unscrew the thing? Let's try it. Maybe it works. I'm a burning the building if I saw that shit. Oh, big brain. Huh. Oh, north, south. Th this got to be north then. South. Oh shit, I don't know which one is east and which one's west. East. West. We need one more. I just YOLO the east and west. It could be wrong. <laughs> West is left. Okay, 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 okay. 
small brain. Okay. 50 <laughs> 50. The burnt one is in the middle. Ah, oh, so ka. Okay, we're looking for east. The E tooth. E. Oh, it could be in the basement actually, right? Right, right. One on each floor. We haven't gone to the basement yet. This is the room with the spooky girl. Ah. Oh. We got another tape. Hunger. Oh, I missed two? Maybe I should go back and look for them? Oh god. Hunger has been tearing at my stomach and yet I didn't die. How long has it been? Is it possible to tell in this endless night? How long must I rot in this fucking prison? No food, no light, no sleep, no contact, nothing, nothing. Just glimpse of life beyond my reach. I wish they would open that goddamn vortex already. I wish they would tear this world apart. I wish they would all end. I need this to end. Hunger in red. Oh, that was because I was choosing. Hi, London Tea, welcome. Okay, I need to look for more tapes, which I haven't been. I haven't been paying attention. I just saw like something was in the in the in the wall, so I kind of like clicked at it. Okay. I th I still really think the tooth is um. Megan. Hello, are you here with us? Nothing on a super gear boy. Hey, where did her necklace go? Huh, I didn't notice it was gone before. That's weird. Maybe that's why she's not coming out. What about the rest of them? I don't know. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I, I think the, the necklace is uh, downstairs. I mean the, the tooth. Did you remove these? Yeah, I did that this morning when I was looking around. Alright, let's double check in there. Mattress. Stacy, are you there? Nothing on the gear boy. Stacy was always difficult to summon, so I'm not surprised she's not showing up now. True. I hope she's at least with Me Megan. Megan. Megan! Megan, come back! Look. Oh lord, this hole. News. So much death and destruction under one roof. Yeah, I feel bad for the Holmes family. They didn't deserve what happened to them. And as much as I want to hate Luke for what he did, I can't help but feel sorry for the dude. He brought it onto himself by helping the council summon a demon. And it just sucks that he had to get Tracy and Megan caught up in it. You think it's really dead? The red-eyed demon? Yeah, I know. Toss Blaster supposedly destroyed it, but it seemed a little too, too easy, didn't it? I know what you mean, but... I know what you mean. I thought the same thing before. We haven't seen any signs of it for years now. What if it like only wound, wounded, it, wounded it and it's just waiting in the dark until s somewhere until it gets better. Then we blasted it back to hell again when it shows up. Ah, uh, They are just so aggressive, aren't they? I like your avatar. Thank you. Thank you. That's so sweet. I'm glad you do. <laughs> can we fix a broken tape using the pocket knife? Uh, we can try. Where was it again? Do you remember where it was again? It was like downstairs, right? Which floor was it? Oh frick, I forgot. I I, I, I just like kind of knew past. I love that game. <gasps> I'm getting really into it. Was it here? No, I don't think so. I think it was like downstairs somewhere, right? This apartment is fucked up. Yeah. Fourth floor all the way to the right. All right. You know what I noticed on one of the walls? Was it here? There was like a yellow, uh, a green goo on the wall. And I, I, I thought of going there, but I forgot. What a camera ripped off. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. True, 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 true. Here. Oh, nice! Oh, that was so big brain. Uh. So is there like one on each floor? Bridge. Why? Why won't you answer me? Every passing moment just silently staring down upon me with no remorse. They're gathering as we speak and they remain... They're me, they mean to open a vortex. Perhaps into this world, a bridge between us and them. Does this not arouse your attention in any way at all? Sometimes I wonder if you're even real. 
Is there anyone behind the lens, or is it just a corpse decaying at the helm? My pleas for help infinitely echoing in the vast emptiness of death. Mm. It's like purgatory. I mean, all three of us are down. I'm down. I don't really care what people say. What do you think? Uh, yeah, sure. Really? I wasn't sure if you'd be into the idea. We should probably revisit this conversation again later. My mind is a little fuzzy right now. You glitched out again while I was talking, didn't you? Yeah, I'm sorry. It's okay, dude. I know you can't control it. Did you get anything useful from it this time? I think so, but I'm still trying to piece it together. Hmm. Could it be like one on each floor? Hmm. A normal day in Ohio. I use my fingers to fix the tape. Honestly, same. Back then, you just use your fingers. You just, <laughs> you just use your fingers and you like kind of twist it back. Did I miss a tape here? Third floor. 304. Oh yeah, the guy. I wonder if he left. Was it this one? Oh no, that was the fourth floor, sorry. I wonder if he left. We could always go check it out. If he didn't, we'll just leave him alone. Glitch IRL. I'm aroused not from curiosity. Oh god. We should let him be alone. The poor dude is weak. Do you think the console will let him leave? I hope so, man. He hasn't been hasn't he been through enough? Yeah, but if he was involved with the cult before his wife died, then try to get out like we think he did. I'm sure they're keeping an eye on him. You're probably right, but they've been quiet for so long. Maybe they aren't operating anymore or whatever. Maybe they've just been laying low waiting for the right moment. Maybe. Either way we'll find them. Alright. Um let's go to the basement. Finger twisting technique. Yeah! That's how you like roll back the, the tape. Alright. Ain't nothing here. Oh, there's the tooth. What, no stupid pun this time? I couldn't really think of any to tell you the tooth. <laughs> oh, that's North. Yeah, there we go. To tell you the tooth! Any tools? I guess we could go down, but do we need to? Do you guys want me to go down? Ew, green goo. Larry's basically Ami <laughs> to tell you the truth. I know. I made a mask of Sally Face. Oh my gosh, please tweet it to me. I would love to see it. <laughs> I would love to see it. It's in the walls, in the shelf. What, you mean the tapes? <laughs> are you gonna use the tooth for something? Yes, actually. We're just uh, we're just gonna go in a bit. It's weird. It would be weird leaving after living here for so long. I felt that way when we left New Jersey, but it was a change I didn't know I needed at the time. <clears throat> so I'm glad it worked out the way it did. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, it'll be awesome to room with you and Todd. I can't wait for that, honestly. So I don't know if I'm, I don't, and I don't know. I'm not, go and I know I'm not going far, but it's still a little sad for some reason. It's a big change, Larry. It's okay to feel emotional about it. You okay? Yeah, I'm cool. Let's just keep looking around. Okay, that way we can actually go outside. So let's check these for a bit. You ain't got nothing in here, do you? Oh no, this is the way to go outside. Remember the first time I saw you without your mask? How could I forget? You were hat banging so hard, it flew right off and whacked me in the face. <laughs> You're so worried about my bloody nose that you didn't even notice it at first. I felt bad. Yeah, but then once I told you I was fine, why did you cry? Because you didn't look away. Aww, that is so wholesome. That is so wholesome. Oh man, that is so sweet. That is so, so sweet. Nothing here? 
I don't think we need to go out or go to the to the to the tree house. We could probably just go straight back up and put the north tooth in. North tooth. Where's the toilet yellow? I know, right? I've been asking that question every single time I go in. Whoa, what is this music? All right, now what? Oh. Oh, because the red arrow was pointing down. Whoa! I think I found the key that you lost. Key! I love keys. I didn't lose it. I just... Wait, where the hell did that even come from? I didn't put it in there. Someone wanted us to find this. They couldn't have just like slipped it under my door or put it in my mailbox or something. <laughs> Reality is a tangled web. Uh, what? <laughs> Never mind. We got the key now. Let's go check out the temple. What temple? I forgot. Achievement unlocked teeth. Old bird cage. It's upside down. Yeah. <laughs> no, he said no. It's so shiny. Who hid it? I have no idea. Wait, what's the key for again? What was the key for? I forgot. <laughs> what was the key for? Huh? Basement? I saw the made in China tag was upside down. What do we need the key for? To solve the code to get to the tape. What? I don't remember. I don't remember. What is the key for? Check the temple. What's a temple? Where, where's the temple? What temple? My friend is here. Oh, hello. Well, I hope you enjoy your time. <laughs> With your friends. Stay safe, guys. Temple? 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 Is it outside? Which temple? I ah, freak. I don't remember why we're doing this. <laughs> Check the temple. Nala, hello. Room 201. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Thank you. Next door, next door, next door, next door, next door, next door. Here? Huh? I don't remember. What are we supposed to do again? What are we supposed to do again? Huh? I forgot. <laughs> I forgot what we're supposed to. <laughs> What's the key for? What? Temple. What temple? Two or three. Two or four. Huh? 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 <laughs> I love how this apartment has no rooms, no bedrooms. <laughs> It's so bizarre. You know what? Maybe I should just Google this because I forgot. It's for the tape. Oh, not the temple. Better stay away from that machine. <laughs> Take care. Thank you for coming. Hope you enjoy your stay and have fun with your friend. Tape. What was it for? I don't remember. 
Do we have to go back our, to our home? <laughs> I'll come back later. Okay. We might not be streaming anymore, but it's okay. We'll be. Uh, I stream every week, anyways. <laughs> CJ's place. David's place. Chuck's place. What's here? I think this room had nothing, right? <laughs> hmm. Let me google this. Where's the key lead to? I forgot. Sally face. Episode 4. Key? Temple. You know what? Huh? Apartment 2B Apartment 2B Enter bedroom 2 Apartment 2B Wait, no? go to the temple oh the temple the temple the temple uh not here where's 2b again how do i get down basement we have to go to the basement right yeah 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 yeah, yeah. okay 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 we do leave the place. Oh, we do? It says to go to the temple. Check the temple. This one. I get goosebumps. What are we here for? Two hours later. <laughs> Everything seems normal here, Larry. Well, normal for Edison apartment at least. What about all those teeth that were glowing birdcage and the key? I guess that was a little odd. This feeling won't go away either. Something bad is coming, dude. I don't know what or when, but I can feel it. You may be right. I'll fill Todd in when he's home and we can come over later tonight with his gadgets. Okay, when is he out of class? He should be out by now, and I'm supposed to meet up with Ash, remember? Alright, you should bring her along. I think we should go easy on her for now with the paranormal stuff. That's true, last time she tagged along, things didn't go too well. Man, that was like years ago now. Seemed like every year just goes by faster and faster. They definitely do. And don't forget that we're all getting di uh, together for dinner tomorrow night. Heh, <laughs> how could I forget? Between you and Ash, I got a lot. I got about a thousand texts about it. Oh, sheesh. Hey Ashley, oh, she grown. She got a bike. I'm too scared. I'm scared. Hold my hand. <laughs> ah! I ship. 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 I missed you too, Ash. You cut your hair. I like it. Thanks. It's easier for writing. I see you change your hair as well. Ah, uh, yeah, I guess. Looks rad though. I do kind of miss the pick. I miss the pigtails. Hey. <laughs> So intel. I haven't been out to the lake since last time we went there together. What's that? I said it's been a long time since I've been to the lake. Me too. It's so nice out there. Peaceful. <laughs> They're like, huh? <laughs> Bruh. She, she's a baddie. 
So you and Ben all good now? This looks like a place from The Conjuring. <laughs> yeah, we're good. What was that all about anyway? Stupid sibling stuff. He called me soulless because I didn't cry out. I didn't cry at grandma's funeral. He said I wasn't human because I never cry and blah blah blah. Then it turned into a big argument. As if I wasn't sad enough about grandma. Anyway, the point is that we made up and we're okay now. You know, now that I think about it, I don't think I've ever seen you cry. Well, I must be some kind of soulless monster. Grr, arr. You better watch out. We kill monsters like you around these parts. <laughs> no, you better watch out. This ain't no monster you want to be messing with. Oh, them is fighting words, Missy. I hope you kiss your mama goodbye this morning. <laughs> I love their interaction. So cute. <laughs> eh, cute. How have you been, Sally Face? Aww. I've been having nightmares. I'm so sorry, are they as bad as before? They're different, it's hard to explain. I've been losing a lot of sleep because of it. Are you worrying about anything? Sometimes if I'm worrying about something or just struggling with something difficult, I get nightmares from that. I've had this overwhelming sense of dread lately and it doesn't make any sense because everything is fine. Everything should be good. Have you been taking those meds? Uh, yeah, most of the time. You should, have taken, you should take them if they help. I have a cousin that struggles with depression too and she said that the, make, the meds uh, she takes help her a lot. Mm -hmm. I guess they do help, but they also make me feel numb inside. That is true. At least with the dread. I know it's real, or at least really me. Sometimes it's hard because you know when you're a singer and you want to emit em emotions, right? You want to be like, never mind, I'll find. But then you feel you, the meds make you so numb, so you're just like, <laughs> now what? <laughs> but yeah, anyways, I'll, I'll tap into that someday. I'll go on a deep dive into that someday. I think I can understand that. I just want you to be happy, Sal. You better make sure you call me if you ever need help or even if you need to talk. You know I'm always here for you, right? I know. Thanks, Ash. And I've said this before, but you know you don't have to wear that around me. My face? Your mask. But it's like a part of me now. It's the face I wear in public. The face I wear all the time. I just want you to know that you don't have to wear it if you don't want to. It's just you and me out here. No one else is around. How does he drink water in public? You know what I'm saying? Emo Rudy? Yeah. Are you really back for good? How have you been? Yeah, you got a problem with that buckle? I don't know, it was kind of nice just with the boys. Adding a girl to the mix sort of throw the whole thing off. Well, you better get used to it because I know you're stuck with me. I missed you, Ash. We all have. It's, it's nice to have you back. Good to be back. I miss you guys a lot. I'm excited to see everyone tomorrow. Where are you gonna stay? With my family for now, they kept my old room just the way I left it. Nice, my dad converted my old room into an office, pretty much as soon as I left. It's only because he was making room for Lisa. True. I still can't believe those two got married. And you and Larry are like, stepbrothers? Yeah, I'm not fully used to it either. It's weird, but good weird. It's good to see my, ha my dad happy again. They are adorable together, to be honest. So are you too! <laughs> they are so cute, I know! Are you happy? Happy with what? Everything. Life. I don't know. That's a hard question. Even though I've had a hard time lately, I try to find things that make me happy. Things that are worth pursuing. Otherwise, what's the point, you know? Yeah. I'm happy right now. Are you sure you're okay, Sal? I'm getting a little worried about you. I don't know. I guess I'm feeling a little off. It just feels like everything is wrong. What do you mean? It feels like nothing puts me at ease. It's this constant feeling of discomfort. Like my soul isn't aligned with my body. Are you sure you're living in reality right now? Could this be a dream? I feel like... I just feel like screaming at the sky until it breaks apart. Well, well what? Let's do it! I don't know. Come on, I bet you'll feel better! <coughs> well, that was the first time we heard his voice. Sally, Sally voice reveal! Woo! <laughs> Yo, Todd, you really let yourself go, boy. <laughs> oh, you re he really let himself go. Oh, sheesh. Hey, Todd. Hey, you back from your date with Ashley already? I don't think it was a date, but yeah. Whatever you say, Sal, how did it go? It was nice seeing her. It's gonna be good to have her back. Indeed, Ashley is a good egg, and our investigations could benefit from the female perspective. Additionally, simply having fresh eyes on our research could prove useful. Speaking of, Larry and I think that there's something weird going on in the apartments again. I told you that I'd bring you over tonight to check it out. Perfect, this will give me an opportunity to, text out, to test out the new things I've been working on. Give me a few minutes to get ready. 
Sure, let me know whenever you're ready to head over. Will do. Oh! I thought that was my phone for a sec. Sal, I'm sorry, dude. Please don't blame yourself. Sorry for what? What are you talking about? It's time for me to go. <gasps> Larry! Larry! Huh? You better not be doing anything stupid. It's too late. I'll be gone soon. Stop messing around, Larry. This isn't funny. Hey? Larry? Pick up. Pick up the phone, Larry. You better pick up. Oh God, Larry. Run, run for us, run. What are you waiting for? Guys! What the fuck? Larry? Larry? Wait, no, that's not his room. Where the hell are you? He was in the, he was in the, he was in the, he was in the, the, the tree house, the tree house. Larry was in the tree house. No. No, Larry. What did you do? Larry, why? <laughs> Larry. Larry. <laughs> Ashley, you look like shit. I was so excited to see Sal, I didn't realize how different he was acting at first. When we were hanging out by the Wendigo Lake, I started to notice it more. At the time though, he just seemed sad to me. I thought maybe he had stopped taking his medications. Miss <laughs> Campbell, at any point during your date with Sal, did you feel as if you were in danger or threatened at all? No sir, it was nothing like that. Sal was one of the sweetest boy I knew. I always felt safe around him, until later that night. <laughs> Can you please explain what you witnessed at the three at the treehouse? It wasn't too long after I had gotten home from the lake that Sal called me, maybe an hour or so. He was clearly shaken up and I could tell from his voice that he had been crying. He told me that Larry was dead. I begged him to call 911. I told him if he didn't then I would. And did neither of you did either of you call 911? No, the boys had me convinced since high school that there was a conspiracy in Knockfell involving the police that they couldn't be trusted. So I went against my better judgment and didn't make the call. I rode over to the apartments right away. When I got to the treehouse, Sal was acting weird, talking to himself and pacing back and forth. Obviously, he was upset. We both were. But I've never seen him like that before. I tried to get him to calm down, but he kept rambling on about cultists and some impending evil. He said Larry was in the treehouse. I took a minute to gather my nerves. I wasn't sure what was going on, if Larry was really dead or if Sal had lost it. I went up to the treehouse, but there was nothing out of place in there except for an empty booze bottle. <laughs> Have you ever known Sal to be a drinker? Not at all. Sal hardly ever touched his stuff. He once told me that he was afraid to get drunk because addiction runs in the family. And he didn't want to become an alcoholic, so I knew something was really wrong. Larry wasn't anywhere to be seen, and Sal was starting to really worry me. I tried to calm him down and reason with him, but he was not receptive to it. I tried to get him inside, but he wouldn't budge. We got into an argument. It was the only time we ever argued. I had to walk away from him. I couldn't be around him like that, and I didn't want to make him worse. Before I left, I left, I let Henry and Lisa know that Sal needed help. They said they'd look after him, and I told him to call me if they needed me. 
I felt horrible leaving Sal like that. I just didn't know what to do. I wish I would have stayed there. I would. I should have stayed with him. I sat my phone. I sat by my phone all night until I got the second call. So Larry was not there. He was. He didn't die. About ten minutes after Ashley left, Tots showed up. He figured something was wrong since I left so suddenly and wasn't answering his texts. He drove over in the van with our gear. I told Todd what Larry did. We both needed time to collect ourselves. Larry was our best friend. The four of us were like family, like I said earlier. Did he sacrifice himself? What happened to his body? I'm not sure he's trying to tell me something, but it's all broken up. I think he's having trouble communicating with us. Let's try out the new gear. I think it will help. Hold on. Wait, is this a new chapter yet? Alright, with the Necrolite modifications I made to your guitar, I believe we'll be able to manipulate the spirit realm in some capacity. How does it work? Turn it on using that G button there. You notice I've added 12 symbols to the neck of the guitar. Play the corresponding notes to activate the symbols. Select a group of, group of notes and then press J, K, or L to strum one of the notes in that group. Try playing all 12 notes. J, K, or L. J, K, or L. Wait, is this a new chapter yet? <laughs> What happened? Todd? Larry? Hello? Ah! Ghost of Alison Rosenberg. Hello, my dear Sally. Who are Rose? The light from your guitar contains magic from another world. It seems that the prophecy may have been true after all. Uh, what? There isn't time to explain. You must use this power to stop them. The devourer, the, the devourers of God have perse persevered despite our vast efforts to stop them. Thank you for the mod. Gravy, you're so fast. So much respect. What the hell was that? A ripple across the fabric of reality. It has begun. You must destroy the barrier spells to reach the source and put an end to it. How will I do that? Use the power of the Necrolites. You'll need help from the spirit realm to reveal what is hidden to you. I cannot be of help in this regard, and I must remain within the black room. Though I can temporarily release your friend Larry from that which binds him. He will be your eyes in the other side. Godspeed, dear Sally. Sal? You put them time out? It's fine. You can time up them first. That's the best way. Huh? You scared the crap out of me. You disappeared and then there was an intense sound that shook the treehouse. Where were you? I, I guess the guitar worked. I saw Rosenberg. She said they called us back. We need to stop them before. For what? What the hell? How did... Larry! Larry! Larry, I think Rosenberg is helping us out. I was stuck in that damn tree house for so long. It's only been a few hours since you, you... You asshole, how could you do this? Why did you leave me? Why? I'm sorry, dude. I really am. But we don't have much time. Rose said the cult is here and... Here now and has to be stopped tonight. It's not going to be easy. I just can't believe this is real. I can't believe you're really gone. Come on, Sal, let's take these fuckers out once and for all. Guys, I need to pee. <laughs> it's been almost four hours, and, and, and I need to pee. <laughs> let's take a toilet break, three to five minutes. I think we can finish this tonight. This has got to be the last chapter. I think this is chapter five already. If not, then we're going to have to continue chapter five tomorrow. <laughs> Or no, not tomorrow, but like some other time. Maybe tomorrow. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Oh my gosh. I gotta pee. I gotta pee. Be right back. Be right back.
<laughs> Hamstar, hello! Let me give you mod. Where's my game? Oh, there it is. Oh boy! Welcome back, thank you! Sorry, one second, one second. Just as I sat down, I needed to help somebody. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, one of my artists is having problems. Eh. <laughs> Man. Ha! <sighs> At least this one replies. At least this one replies. Sometimes you just want a, an artwork to just be done swiftly and easily. Ha! Mmm, sorry for the wait. How are you guys? Are you hanging on well? Because we are almost four hours in. And this might take an hour. Or we try to noob through it, but it might take an hour. Artist that replies, thank you, Hamstar, thank you, bless your heart. Man, sometimes I commission artists and they don't reply me for weeks. And then when they do, it's like a stupid question that we could have solved it a long time ago. Like, they could have been working on the commission for like months. Huh. Ah, excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, I'm so gassy. All right. <laughs> yeah, I would hate that. I mean, when I was a, when I was about to do the reason why I, I delayed my debut so many times um, was because artists were ghosting me and they would reply to me and I gave them a deadline. We agreed upon the deadline before I commissioned them. And then some of them ghosted me after they took my money and then they came back with the reasons like Oh, you were on the waitlist and I was like, I checked your waitlist You you even told me that the TAT uh, the, 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 what's it called again? Estimated, the uh, Estimated time or something? Something like that? Like the time that they could, they're gonna take to um, finish my art was like only like what, few days? Up to a week? <laughs> yeah Terrible man, I'm telling you Ha! Eh. <laughs> eh. All right, let's continue. What in the? <laughs> Hi, Wolfie. Hello. Art block? No, they just. I don't know. They just. They decide to ghost you, I guess. Yeah. Especially when they give money. That is true. I paid them. Yeah. I have no problems with payment. It's just like I just get ghosted. That's sad. What on earth is this? This can't be good. What what are we supposed to do? Destroy the barrier spells. Huh. What am I 
I supposed to do here? <laughs> Ghost things that- yeah, they take my money. It's like... How am I supposed to know what key to play? Larry's note. Sal, I know this is going to be hard for you to understand. I'm sorry. Please don't blame yourself and please don't hate me. I was lucky to have you in my life. I couldn't have asked for a better brother than you, dude. I know you're going to do great things. You got to keep going. Keep fighting the darkness. It's coming closer now. I can hear it whispering in my head. It's getting louder. I just need this to end. I can't take it anymore. I'm not strong like you are. I love you, Sally Face. Always. See you on the other side, Larry. What? Switch to Larry? Switch... Switch to Larry? I don't think the police would care yet. What? Larry, this is the dead stone. Press R to squeeze it tightly and summon the power from within. You must use this an ancient relic to assist Sally. What does it do? Hello? Press R? Nani the heck? Press R to summon his power. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Am I supposed to press R again? Hello? Hello? <laughs> what? Hansen? What am I supposed to do now? Eh? Nani? This can't be good. Can't be good. Okay. Well, I guess we keep trying then. Oh, 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 sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm dumb, I'm dumb, I'm dumb, I'm dumb. Where's that one? Drop down. Hey, yo, hello. Drop down. So we're just gonna keep going down? Yeah, see, I saw this green goo. I was gonna touch it. We still have more films we need to take. Hmm. Leave this floor? No. Well, what else can I do? I can't go into any of these rooms. Oh, unless... Oh, Larry, you gotta follow us, man. You gotta follow tight, man. Ew. What is it? R. Oh, nice. Can't company to dance. This sleep is pu punching me. Good luck. Have fun. Thank you to Edgar. Thank you so much for staying to the end. I mean, almost the end. For staying for four hours. Thank you so much. Otsu, 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 Otsu. I always appreciate you. Thank you. Good night. Sleep well. Happy Amir Mir. Oh. Nani? He gone. Am I supposed to do something here? Okay, this is trippy because I have to constantly switch. Mm. Okay. Well, that's just conf Oh, okay. I got the key. 504 key. I kind of wish that Larry would teleport next to him. Hmm. I'm going back to 505. There's no handle. 
room bro i went 10 minutes away and now larry's a ghost yeah yeah is he astro projecting no he he gave up on his own life and now he's helping us as a ghost i feel like we need larry in here I feel like we need him to help help us here. Oh, here's the handle. Is the girl here? Doesn't seem like it. Oh, I hate this place. Oh, okay. This is so trippy. Now it's gonna take twice the time to do stuff. <laughs> the box as well. The box on the wall. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Which one was that? Skin. We're missing one. Mumbling. It's not here. She's not alive anymore and we won't be. We're so hungry now. And this skin, this fucking skin, it's so itchy. Why? This skin isn't mine. This skin isn't mine. Isn't mine. It's not mine. Isn't mine. Isn't mine. Isn't mine. Isn't mine. Should be a K pop song. No, just me. Okay. Right. There's a noose that looks dead stonable. Um, I guess. I mean, the news was always there. Wasn't it? Would there be an indication? Nah. I wonder if it will, like, be extra dark if it's something that I need to dip. Dark stone. Da what is it called? Death stone? <laughs> Hi, Rafakun! Yeah, we're streaming for four hours now. I'm trying to complete this game. I think we could do it tonight. We are on the last episode after all. Hmm. Yeah, I wish they could just teleport to one another. Hmm. Still strong on streaming. Yeah, I really want to find out what the hell happened. The mystery is so good. The suspense. Alright. Leave this floor? Yes. I wonder if we could get back up. I don't think so though. Maybe Larry can. I don't know. Oh, here we go. Zappy finger, yeah. I don't think you can grab the other tape anymore. You needed the pocket knife. Uh huh. Oh, that's fine then. That's okay. Kind of just want to progress into the story, like the main story. Like, what is it about? Um, that didn't work. Oh! Oh shit, are you two okay? What the hell is this? Mom, Henry? If you can hear if you can't hear me, we're gonna fix it. Just hold on. Eh. If you can hear me, we're gonna What the fuck? What? Okay, you know what? Let's bring him back.
it's not lighting up, so I don't think I can do anything. Mom, Dad? What are you guys doing? We're watching TV, but what's the point, really? These shows are all the same. Everything has become so predictable. Uh, are you two alright? We're fine, Sal. Just fine. Everything is peachy. Okay. I don't know. Can I help my parents? What do I do here? Is that normal? No, 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 no. I've tried to zap it. It doesn't work. Do we come back? <laughs> Let's come back later. I feel like I should sneeze, but I can't. <coughs> there we go. <coughs> oh my goodness. And that's when I don't sleep enough. <laughs> Sounds like something happened in the hallway. <laughs> Triple kill. Get what ass. Okay, let's switch. Are okay. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Can we save them now? Oh shit! This is not my house. My <sighs> gosh. Oh, they're better now. It worked. Do it anyway for good measure. <laughs> Do it one last time anyway. The nose is so itchy. Oh lord. Huh? Herman, what the hell happened to you? You look like shit, dude. I could say the same to you. Wait, what a minute. How, how are you here? Same as you dead. No, I mean, how are you in this room? The spirits should be confined in the, to their place of death. Sandy should be here, but it's too late. I was too late. She's gone. All of the souls have assimilated. Rosenberg, like, broke the spell that was holding me in the treehouse or something. I'm not really sure. You know what happened to the other ghosts? Does it have to do with the cult? It doesn't matter now. Nothing does. I just have to wait here until it takes me. It's the faith. It's the fate we all face eventually. It's not too late, Sal. It's Sal's going to stop this thing. I'm going to help him do it. Your efforts will be wasted. Take this. Take this. For fuck's sake. Oh my gosh! Herman, come on! You were alive the other time! Oh my god! I guess this is what he meant when he said he was leaving. Oh no. Herman... I'm so sorry, guys. I should have mentioned a lot of trigger warnings at first. Kitty voice, thank you, Cloud. Hello. I'm so sorry. You walked in on a very gruesome scene. <sighs> but yeah, F in a chat. This is what I watched first. Dia, <laughs> I'm so sorry you walked in on this too. It's a heavy game. I'm very sorry. <sighs> oh, shit. This room is all dark. Am I moving? I don't know. Okay, let's see what he sees. <laughs> Mommy, I'm scared. Please pick me up. <laughs> Here's another film. Evolve. 
Oh god. The, these ghosts so full of life, strong, healthy blood, tender meat. Oh, how we crave their flesh, yet they deny us soon. <laughs> soon we will be there, and they have, will have called, and we will have answered. The floor is moist. Is this me? You are on your period. There's nothing left. We have consumed. I beg your, 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 your pardon? <laughs> what? <laughs> Mommy, I'm scared. Pick me up. No, we are in this together. Huh? <laughs> Ayo? You, Ayo, sus? <laughs> you guys. Y'all are down bad. Also, excuse me. Um, alright, we need our brother. <laughs> She's like, the floor is moist and it's me. Is it me? I don't know, you tell me. Good God. Oh my goodness. Who's this? Who's this? I don't remember. Oh, that's the dude and his sick girlfriend, David. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would never pass up the chance to be sex. Oh my god. Honestly, I'll take this any day. All right, we need to find a kind of like tear. If you if you watch Bioshock Infinite, like some kind of tear in the in. Oh, we can't. What am I supposed to do? We need to find a tear, like um, and then zap it. There has been no tear. A tear with light light source. Nanny the hat. How about pick up Zero, Zero and then you pick us up there? No! <laughs> He's heavy, are you sure? Takashi Yuta, hello, welcome! How are you? Maybe we gotta be a human for the. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Maybe radi Radio and Sally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I thought too. Maybe we should come in. We must look for beyond the anguish of life, deep in the true nature of all things. Therein lies our salvation. Is this your girlfriend? Oh, it is! His girlfriend has been a freaking mannequin this whole time. My strange addiction. Hello? Hello? Look at the wedding photo. <laughs> and she's been sick. The last time he saw her, he said she's been sick. <laughs> My strange addiction. My wife is a... It's a mannequin. I guess that's some sort of doll if you're brave enough. Hey, what's up? Sally Face, good to see you. Hello, Sal, what's happening? Guy can make it, can't stay for long. I'm sort of in the middle of something. Gonna see you guys. Good to see you though. Are you feeling alright? We're just dandy, but everything is peachy. You should stay. Yeah, it'd be best for you to stay here. There's no use in fighting it, my friend. I really should be going now. Everything's fine, don't worry, Sal, you see. What? Am I supposed to choose this? Oops, sorry. That's the lad's business. Oh, here we go. Alright. <laughs> Bye. I love how I was like, oh, I'm just here not for long. Five minutes later, goodbye. Oh, sorry, I forgot. What a weird keys. All right, let's be the brother because I feel like it's easier to open tears and walk around than us just blindly not knowing what's going on. Cousin of Rich Brian, bruh. Alright. 
Uh, I think those two rooms are fine. We probably just gotta go check out where the tape is in the other room. Oh, just took something. Dark Pony. Found her soda stuff. I don't think it belongs to her. All right. We just stole a kid's toy. <laughs> All right. Uh, time to be Sally up high. <laughs> hey, dude. How are you feeling, buddy? Feeling? Yeah, there's uh, something going on around. I think it'll be cleared up soon enough, though. Soon? Yeah, just keep an eye on Soda, okay? Soda? Your daughter, remember? She's sitting right next to you. Oh my gosh, what is going on with him? He's losing it! Alright, let's be our brother again. They're all attached to the TV. Yeah, they're watching the TV or something. I did not get the tapes on that floor. But at the same time, I kind of don't really care no more. I want to know what's going on! Oh god. What's up with the toilet? What's so special about the toilet? Oh, maybe the brother pin can come through. Your turn, bruh. Oh god. Their eyes are so red. Ew! Toilet! Oh, I flushed it. You're not about to pick up something from it. So you flushed your toilet for them? And then what? <laughs> <laughs> he goes in to flush the toilet. No, but these guys don't have TVs. Right? They don't have a TV. They're just like that. There's something floating in the toilet. I guess I should. Ugh. It's a key. Found in the toilet. Yuck. Okay. Oh, actually, we should be the brother. She is high as a kite, yo. Oh. This is a crazy lady's apartment, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Nothing here for him, unless the brother comes through. Um, she's living the dream, bro. Now we watch, we use TV to watch YouTube. That's true. Some people don't have TV. For the longest time of me living alone, I didn't have a TV, and I was fine by it, 100%. Ain't no problem. I didn't have a problem with you know, without a TV. Funny TV when we can watch other streams. <laughs> I use the phone and the laptop the most most of the time. Oh, oh yeah. What did you see? Are we in the wrong apartment? Oh here we go. Bye zip 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 zip. What is here anyway? Hmm. 
laptop, sorry. Or decent speakers, uh-huh. You can add 300 ringgit projector for- Oh yeah, I did have a projector, but I didn't really use it much. I did have a projector though, and I would project it up to the sky because that was the only like large and c clean part of the room. <laughs> Alright, there's nothing here. Because, you know, if you have a projector and you have like stuff on the walls, posters, whatever, and you put a projector, it's not really that nice. So if you have it on the TV, uh, if you have it on a ceiling, then uh, it's pretty nice. Yeah, it's nice and white. You can just lay on the bed and look up to the sky. Mm. Yeah. Oops, sorry. Alright, let's do this. G. What's this? Nice. Woo! Alrighty, let's cross to the other side. Hello from the other side. You know. Projector is kind of a hassle to set up. Them. Actually, not really. Um, I had the, um, which call that? Oh, the door still doesn't exist. That door doesn't exist. Uh, I had the, oh frick, what do you call that? Um, portable one, so I could just bring it everywhere. It was so tiny too, and I lived in a. I lived in a. A small apartment. By myself, so it was enough for me. Do we need to do something here? Huh. Alright, I'll make I'll make the brother come through this room first instead of the first door. Cause Larry couldn't go through. Yeah, 203. 15 inch TV tiny, my switch is like 24 inch, and it's like okay, but eh. Back in the day, TVs were like boxed, you know what I mean? They were like the big boys. Uh, okay, there's nothing here. But there was a summoning circle here. Summoning circle, why am I struggling to say that? Summoning circle. Hmm, interesting. I guess I just wait here until he opens the door for me. <laughs> How do you find a 300 ringgit projector though? One I've been seeing is like 4k or uh, 1k. I think you have to look on um I don't know. What? Up? He has the key though. He has the key. Uh I think you have to look on Shopee and um Wait, what? Could be here. How do I... What do I do here? Did I miss something? Maybe I missed something. Oh god. Here, maybe I can wash it? Can I wash this? You bet. She can't see the pony in the chat. What pony in the chat? Put the dark pony. Oh, the dark pony! Okay, 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 okay. Wait, what? Here? Oh shit! Yeah, I didn't think of that. What? Oh. Huh. 
rage. Why do they torment us so, slipping from our grasp? These filthy fucking pigs, they are swine at the feet of God. Animal corpses dragging their claws about and scurrying across the dirt, rearranging things, always rearranging. We will an an anni an annihilate every... I used to pronounce annihilate for the longest time. I would say annihilation. Annihilation. <laughs> annihilate every molecule of their pitiful existence. Girl, you sound just like you're obsessed. Alright, so there's that. Now can we come in here now? I can't. I don't know if the brother can see the door yet. <laughs> what a weird pronunciation. It's A-N-I-H-I Annihilation. Annihilation. Why is that weird? Annihilation. I don't think I can get into this door at all. How do I get here? <laughs> Cutest mistake. Nah. Any any hay lotion. <laughs> yeah, annihilation. A n i a n i h i h i l a t i o n. Annihilation. I can't open this. How do I do this? Huh? Say woo. 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 G. Please don't spam. How do I open this door? It's annihilation. I know it's annihilation, but yeah, I used to pronounce it as annihilation. Annihilation. Annihilate. <laughs> Freaking English, man. Hey guys, how do I get in? Yeah. Any word could sound weird enough if you say it repeatedly. That's true. If you stare at a word for too long, it starts looking weird. And I don't know how to explain it. Even Sal can't get in. Yeah. Maybe they run out of stuff to put in the room. Should we just... Do I put this here? Can I wash it? Here's the thing, none of the things are clean. Yeah. Don't think there's anything since you found the tapes. That's true. Let's go down then. Thank you. I mean, some words look wrong just from the get-go. <laughs> Actually, yes. Wait, which floor are we? Is this the first floor? Oh shit, it is. Hmm. Are you Japanese? No, I'm Malaysian. I'm Malaysian Chinese. Yes. Yes, I am. Oh, that's locked. Rosenberg's old place. Hello, Mrs. Gibson? There's a rancid smell coming from her room. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Annihilation. So, I think this is supposed to indicate that the door is here. Um, but I don't know. Can't, can't get in. Alright. Can I? Brother? Can you? No. Okay. A hybrid of Malaysia and China? No, I was just a Chinese born and raised in Malaysia. Yeah. We have a lot of us here. Because we are multiracial! We have a lot of Indians here too. Ah, I was too slow. Who knows? 
Giri giri da. I was like one second away from not passing that one. I would never get into her place ever, huh? Young boy stands at the threshold of oblivion, mesmerized by the eternal abyss. Tormented and bound by the world of mankind. Oh my goodness gracious. Prisoner of flesh and bone. Terence? How long have you been like this? What has he been feeding us? Oh! Did the cult do this to you? The child does not choose his own fate, it has always been this way. You will soon understand the true harmony of the en Endless One. <laughs> yeah, we have indigenous people too. We have a lot of races. Recently, we've gotten a lot of foreigners. And they're actually super duper 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 funny people. <laughs> I have two foreigners as my colleagues and they're freaking hilarious. <laughs> I don't know, man. People these days got a sense of humor and I love it. <laughs> Are you the endless one? Why are you infecting the souls in this building? I beg your pardon. Darkness moves through all things and obeys our will. We are everlasting. We are beyond death. Terence, I know you're in there somewhere. You have to stop this. You speak the name of a child who is no more. Your struggle is meaningless. Then I will stop you myself. Listen here, you big pile of booger. Watch your tone. You will try and you will fail as it always is. Shut your mouth. He's not having it. Oh god, oh god, I am not ready. I'm not ready. Oh! Hello, suddenly I'm playing a freaking rhythm game? Goodness gracious, this is ear rape, dude. I've been waiting for you, Sal. I knew you'd be the one. I knew from the moment I saw you. Terence? My apologies, good sir. I haven't been quite myself and I've caused so much pain. Is it over now? Almost. I'm afraid there's one more task remaining. And it is a hideous one. Whatever it is, I will do it. Whatever it takes to end is for good. You must kill all those who have been tainted by the dark. But that's everyone in this building. Those are my friends and family. We've cleared the darkness from their souls. We've already saved them. I'm afraid it's too late for them, Sal. Their souls are destroyed beyond repair. If left unchecked, the shadows will keep them... will seep through these cracks and many more lives will be extinguished. My heart weighs heavy in sorrow for you. I know you will lose everything just as I had many years ago. I don't think I can do this. Please don't make me do this, Terence. It is your choice to make. I know it's an extraordinary burden to bear, but I also know that you will do the right thing. I... First of all, how are we supposed to know that he's a good guy? You just have this freaking stranger 
well, I whatever supposed to be supposedly Terrans come up to us and tell us to kill our entire family. Addison is right, Sal. This must be done. I'm so sorry. I wish there were another way. But you were a phantom. I mean, we have to do this because we are in jail, right? There's no other way. We can't go out. We can't go out. We can't go out. You don't get a choice. No, you don't. I mean, we are in jail for murder. I can't go out. Now you understand? What do you understand? Can you swap to Larry? Nope. Kill. Goal kill. There is no Larry. Larry who? We have to do it do it out of the no choice. Oh lord. Why are you out here anyways? Why do you look like this? <laughs> Why is she like this? Huh? Why is she just do random people do you know what? I have a question to ask. Do people just freaking roll out of their apartment like this and just chill in front of their door? <laughs> It's my destiny. Oh my goodness gracious. All right, fuck it. Let's do it. I don't feel well. Would you help me get into my apartment cell, please? Oh my god. Uh, she was being nice for one cell, you fucking asshole. Oh my goodness gracious. Sally face, have you seen a little Todd around? We need to talk to him. Oh, this game is so dark. I can't even go anywhere. I can't even leave the room. There's nothing I can click. But freaking F. F in the chat, guys. Hey, dude. Glad you decided to come back. Now we can really get this party started. Oh, my goodness gracious. Sally, maybe you do deserve jail time. There's Even even if it's to prevent, you know, whatever thingy from happening. You, Hey, Sally, you feeling all right? I think there's something going around. You deserve the jail time for life. Just just take it. Not the wooden waifu too. Sally fast, can I hide on your can I white on your shoulders now? Oh my god, the fucking kid. And your childhood friend. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Astaga, astaga. His his poster on the on the photo says nope a coke, that's so yeah bet. And he's a kid around in the house. He's your sponsor, you fucking bitch. What's up, my man? You're looking a little worse for wear. Everything okay? Oh my god, everybody cared for him, you know. Yeah. No, 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 no. Look at all the photos. Oh my god. I there's no way to leave without killing. There is no way. You can't get out. There's nowhere else to go. Yeah, I can't even press F. I can't leave. The only objective is to kill. I can't leave. I think it had to it had to be this because he the whole plot and the whole mystery of when he was telling the story was because he was in jail for murder. What time is this? Um, you mean what time is it at my place? It's almost 1 a.m. It's 12.45 a.m. It's morbid time. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. All right, this is it. Hey, kiddo, there's some leftover lasagna in the fridge if you're hungry. I love you both. You know, I may not say this enough. I'm proud of you, Sal. You've come a long way, and I know it hasn't all been easy. <sighs> I look at you now, and I'm excited about the man you're becoming. I think you've got a bright future ahead of you. I really do. Papa, don't be like this. I love you, buddy. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You're going to hell, Sally. You're going to hell. You're going to hell. You might as well take the demons with you. can't go in here
Does that know they have to die for the safety of the world? No, unfortunately not. Something is wrong. I blacked out in a treehouse and woke up in a temple. They had me tied down. There was something else there. I think it was the demon. They cut me and took some of my blood. There was a loud sound and I passed out again. When they came to, I, they were gone and I was untied. I don't feel right, Sal. I think I'm dying. Had to stop by Era, thank you so much for dropping by. Oh my gosh, you dropped by at like the final moment. Like the, the, oh my goodness gracious. It was around 3 a.m. when I got the next phone call from Todd. He was crying so hard that I could barely make up what he was saying. I knew Todd and Sal were in trouble and they, they were at the apartment. It sounded serious so I called the police and wrote over there right away. I got there just as the police showed up. On my way to the front door, I saw Todd running into the woods. I called out for him but he just kept running. I approached the building and Sal was standing in the doorway, covered in blood, just staring out. He was mumbling the same thing over and over again. I had no choice. I had to do it. There wasn't any other way. <sighs> I tried to talk to him, but he was unresponsive. The cop pulled me away before I got any closer to him. Sal isn't an evil man. He's not a bad person. He just needs help. Dr. Annan, you've handled Mr. Fisher's psychiatric, psychiatric assessment during his time in prison, including several months of therapy sessions. Is this correct? He died. Yes, that is correct. Didn't this motherfucker die? Didn't he fall down a treehouse? Did he or did he not fall down a treehouse? Or did I picture that? Did I dream of that? Is it, is it me? I... I... Huh? This is just the end of episode 4? <laughs> he did fail! And what have you concluded from your time with the defendant? It is my professional opinion that Sal Fisher is perfectly sane! Excuse me, and was 100% lucid when he proceeded to murder the occupants of Addison Apartments. The elaborate story he concocted is simply that a story he is trying to he's not giving him a case to plead um insanity oh my god a tale to make him out of out to be the hero rather than the villain he was so convincing that even i began to believe his story i went into the apartment to visit the treehouse as cell requested there was nothing there at all in fact the further i poked into the story the more incons inconsistencies there were these inconsistencies along with all of the contradictory evidence proved to me that cell is not delusional but simply lying to protect himself in your opinion, is Sal Fisher a threat to the public? He's gonna say yes. Absolutely, without a doubt. For fuck's sake. How is this the end of episode 4? Are you, are you serious? You are, you are an imposter. You vent it. You vent it. <laughs> I can't take this judge seriously. I'm sorry. <laughs> Members of the jury, have you, have you reached a verdict? Yes, Your Honor, we have reached a verdict. In the case of South Fisher versus the county of Knockville, what do you say? The county of Knockfell, what say you? Oh my gosh, the whole county is in on it. <gasps> Wait! The members of the jury find the defendant guilty of first degree mass murder. Wait! The doctor is not the doctor. Someone else is wearing his skin. Remember? Remember the, the river? The, the Remember the lake that they went to? That um, him and Ash went to it's called wendigo lake wendigo lake wendigos are known to wear your skin wendigos are known to um impersonate you and 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 and, pre and pretend to look like you and act like you it's in the american folklore american yeah 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 wendigo is it is it connected i don't know it's giving me goosebumps i agree with the jury on the verdict of guilt 
and because of the severity of the crime committed, I hereby sentence Sal Fisher to receive capital punishment. <gasps> we're gonna be we're gonna be hung or poor, or or what do you call that? What do you call that? Skinwalkers. Isn't the other name Wendigo 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 Wendigo? <laughs> Executed, yeah. Either we're hung or poisoned or the electric chair. I don't think they do electric chairs anymore, do they? Yeah. Like VTubers, except they were real human skins. Oh, Lord. No, he can't do that. He's sick. He needs our help. Order. Order in the court. Oh, Ash, you fucked up. Three years later, Ash had tried in almost every way she could think of to prevent Sal's execution and failed with each attempt. Now she sits in her living room as the news reveals that today is the day Sal will be executed. A deep sadness washes over her. It's then an idea comes to Ash that could change everything, though she'd have to act fast. Three years later! Larry, are you here? Please, dude. If you're here, then show yourself. We really need to help Sal. He's in trouble. I brought some of your old music. Another time skip. Yeah. If this doesn't work, then this is the last time I'm coming up here. Larry? Holy fucking shit. Hey, Ash. You guys were telling me the truth this whole time. Well, yeah, duh. I knew it. Well, I had my doubts, obviously, but I really, really wanted to believe it. Just don't fall out of the tree. <laughs> Just don't fall out of the treehouse, okay? Huh? Never mind. How are we gonna help Sal? Oh, I have a plan. Just hold still for a sec. Shit, that's bright. <laughs> damn. Oh, damn. Yes, I got it. Phasmophobia? Is it a three-star photo? Come on, Sally! I mean, sorry, I'm in my ash. Step on it! What's the point of showing the photo? Would that make them believe them? I'm afraid you're too late, honey. They're strapping him in now. Wait, he was telling the truth. I have proof, please. You have to wait. Just let me show you what I found. Oh, no. Hey! Hey, wait! It is the electric chair. No. No. Well, bitch, you fucked up. You have fucked up so many times in this series. At first, I was rooting for you, girl. I liked you. Time of death is 6.33 p.m. Cell. So, oh, God, no. Achievement unlocked. Suffer. Oh, girl. Cassandra Sanderson Herman Robert Silva Morrison Sal Fisher, son of Henry and Diane Fisher I wish you were here, Sal Sorry, I haven't visited in a few nights. Things have gotten worse. Well, well, well. It's been five months since Todd escaped from the institution. I hope he's okay. He's gotta be under that darn church. It's the one place we haven't been able to get to. They're down there. I know they are. And they have my Todd. Did you get the rest of that C4 from your army friend? C4? I got it last night. Have you found a way in? I think so. Yeah, we should go Tuesday night. That's when they're least active. Remember our agreement. If we get caught down there, we won't. We're going to get Todd and blow that place to bits. Neil, I'm serious. So am I, but if we do get caught, then yeah, we take them down with us. I'm ready. Good, at least one of us is. They're gonna blow the place up? 
Oh shit. Summary of cultist notes. Do we find out Sal's face? No, we didn't actually. We didn't see his face ever. They're blowing up the church, I think. Yeah, yeah, they're pulling up. Legal crap. Yeah, 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 that's true, that's true. They don't, um... I think she, for her, she's just... Ugh, I don't know, she's being annoying. She took three damn years. <laughs> Thought he's been affected by the dark. This has occurred in other people across Knockville and it's usually brought on by the devourers of God. Oh, good God, that's so long. <laughs> he's safe there. We can figure out how to break him out. In the meantime, we have to continue Todd's work on finding a cure to reverse the infection and cleanse the possessed body. I believe we are close to figuring it out. We just need more time. Are you telling me Todd this whole time could have invented something like that and freaking Sally didn't have to kill everybody? Mysterious Mailer, a cultist insider providing helpful intel, but who is it? Why are they betraying the cult to help us? We still don't know the answer to these questions. Cool. Phelps Ministry. It's not simply an old church that sits on Chapel Hill. It's the church is the entry point for the main temple of the Devourers. Alright. We're playing as her now. Hey Akun! TLDR what? TLDR, yeah, I just literally I just read like pieces of it, but that's pretty much what it meant. Aw. I remember taking this photo. It was after Larry's dad left. Larry and his mom stayed with his grandmother for a few years. They lived down the road from me. That's when we became good friends. Why does she walk like that? <laughs> Tomorrow's a holiday. We're not sleeping till we're done. Let's go. I know. I want to finish this. And I have a stream tomorrow during the day too. <gasps> Gizmo! 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 You can never believe what happened, Gizmo. You have no care in the world, Gizmo. She's gonna have back problems in the long run. Yeah, I know, right? Man, I have Resident Evil stream. <sighs> Tomorrow during the day. What time is it? Freaking 1 a.m. We'll power through this. Is that a Totoro poster? That is a freaking Totoro poster on the wall. Look at it. Look at that. My neighbor Totoro. Da, 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 da. I work tomorrow. Oh no, you should sleep. You don't have to stay up tomorrow. Thank you. Gizmo, you need anything? He hasn't left your room since the execution. It's like he knows. Yeah, they do. Mm. With the baby Gizmo. Who the fuck? Maple? Hey Maple, how are you today? Neil and I are gonna get Todd back soon. We may need to stick him with you at least until we can figure out a better solution. That is fucked up! I hope you don't mind. <laughs> I gotta run to the shed real quick, but when I get back in, we'll get you some nice warm soup. What? <laughs> well, she was not killed, sure, but... Holy shit. Note on Maple's corruption. Maple has become a threat to herself and others and had to be locked up. Most of the time, she remained conscious and alert. She's grateful that we're working away to find a way to help her. The corruption seems to be mostly active at night. Today, we reinforced the cage and added restraints for everyone's safety. Maple didn't love the idea but understood why they were needed. Day 20. The infection is getting worse. We were only able to speak with her 50% of the time. There was a time she acts like some kind of demon or something, driven by violence. Day 32. Maple has become difficult to interact with or at all and at, with at all and her physical appearance has become to change. She started screaming during the night and it didn't stop till her throat bled. The screaming has continued these past few nights. Luckily no one lives close enough to hear it and the basement muffles most of us down anyway. Her screaming finally stopped day 45, but she's not looking so great. Day 46, we can't get her to eat anything. Day 51, she's still refusing to eat. We've been force feeding her as much as we can, but it's very difficult. Day 64, Maple is starting to smell pretty bad, still not eating. 
Is that salad fingers? What? So they gotta do what they gotta do. She's possessed. That's true. Oh, fuck. I have the password. Achievement unlocked. Memorized. <laughs> if only. <laughs> it's only because I'm a Virgo and I write down my notes on a physical paper. Todd's notes. The final prophecy of Sitil... Sit Tlali Gray, a rough and incomplete tran uh, translation. The blue flame not extinguished. Blah 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 blah. blah. Notes Tlali a native Native American seer. The devourers of God, possibly of the original formation. Asinima collection of three pyramids. I've attained one of them and have been researching the. I've been searching the other two. I'm not exactly sure who the child of the ab 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 abomination is, but if they're an enemy of the cult, they're then they could be a much needed ally. Hmm. <laughs> Gamer moves, yeah. Grab the package, yes. We got these weird pyramid things in the mail. Another package came from a mysterious cultist insider. Todd had a third pyramid in the shed. In his notes, he says he found it in the temple under the old apartments. They seem to be pretty important. <laughs> There are several mentions of a prophecy in Todd's notes about them. He was actively looking for the other two. I think they might just be linked to you somehow. Is she summoning him? No matter how I turn these, nothing happens. I thought something would happen this time. Girl, you take a long time to think about these things. So there's something else I need to tell you. I'm pregnant? Question mark. The replacements were sloppy at first, but they're getting better now. It's harder to tell the difference. I can't trust anyone. These things creep me out, dude. They aren't human. I know what you mean. So you think that a pyramid thing that Todd found could help us find Sal? It seemed like it. I've pieced together what I could find about the old cult prophecies. And from what I can tell, there are three pyramids that will summon their destruction. All signs point to Sal as one of the ones who can stop them. I'm not sure how or why, but it's the best chance we have. Pragante? Praganart? I always knew Sally Face would do great things. Don't give up on him, Ash. You have to find him. I won't, ever. I just need to find the other two pyramids. Once I'm free from this fucking treehouse, I will help you find him. Larry, I don't know if this is a good idea. What if burning down the treehouse only makes it worse? Trust me, it can't get any worse. I can't live like this anymore. Or you know, not live, but whatever. I can't stay stuck in this place. You don't know what it's like. It's torture. I can feel it changing me. Nothing else has worked to try break, break, to break the binding spell. What if you end up in a black room instead of being free? Your soul will dissolve into the darkness. We don't know what that for sure, and even so, nothingness will be better than existing like this. Please, Ash, you have to help me. If I do this, you have to promise you'll be okay. Promise me you won't fade away. I promise. We burn in the treehouse down. I hope the grandma can help him again. Prego. I went back to the burnt tree house every night for three weeks. He's just gone. I can't bring myself to go anymore. Another screw up in the long list of my failures. Yeah, huh? This morning I went over to Neil's place, but... He can't take it anymore, huh? Hello, Neil, you home? I think it's too much for him. Grab the C4 from Neil's backpack since we were supposed to go to the temple that night. Todd's notes. Todd's notes. The Gray family is a tribe of Native Americans, but there aren't many historical records of them. Even though there are three, they're relatives of the Gray living in Knockfeld today. Their ancestries appear to be more legend than fact. It is said that their family was formed when a great owl swooped down from the night sky and made love to a man who was lost in the woods. What? 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 Okay, this we gotta read. This we can't do a TLDR. This this is a whole fan fiction. Let's, let's read it. <laughs> Weeks later, a beautiful young woman burst out from inside of the man. 
And a nearby pack of wolves came to eat the bits and flesh of the man. By eating this flesh, the wolves became indebted to the young woman. Over time, the pack became human and together with the young woman formed the first family, first members of the great tribe. Descendants of the woman were said to have the ability to see the future. The origin story was likely fabricated but then evolved over time. However, there may be grain of truth proclamation of psychic abilities. Ariel! Cat! Excuse me. Miku! That took a turn on Whiskey Tango Foxtrot Lane, bro. We spicy now. The slaughter, slaughtering of children. August 16, 1984. 255 children and 32 adults were murdered across North America. However, surprisingly, it didn't make any headlines. The story was covered here and there, but not by any major news outlets. It is now my understanding that the cult has something to do with this and was like the, the orchestrator of the whole thing. If true, that could mean their ex reach extends much further than we expected. A terrifying thought. Yeah, I mean, they had a lot of sacrifices. They sacrificed a lot of people. How's the girl? Did we ever feed her the soup that we promised? <laughs> I hope we did. Sales room. Gizmo, he's still sleeping. Bitch, if you ever stop feeding Gizmo, I will choke you to death. Bathroom. I've been here for like 15 minutes. Hmm. <gasps> she broke out. Crap, this isn't good. That sounded like the front door. Oh, shit. This is the back door. Oh my god. Maple, 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 maple. Maple, maple, oh maple. Girl, why do you walk like this? Letter? This was there was a note left on the table for me. Hey Ash, they have maple and Neil. You need to move quickly. Huh? Ash, they have Maple and Neil, you need to move quickly. The temple is lightly guarded today. Sneak into the entrance I told you about before. Once you get into the main chamber, you have to act stealthily. There are four pillars with insets that hold sacred jars. If you place the explosive there, it's sure to bring the whole place down. Stick them behind the jars and they'll be safe. It's forbidden to touch those jars. Be careful and good luck. On the back of the letter, there's a hand-drawn map with the location of the jars. I didn't waste any time. I went to the temple right away. This is why I don't keep possessed people in the basement. I know why. Do not enter. Okay, so where am I right now? Where am I right now? What do I have? C4, 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 detonator. Okay. This is... Huh? This is the first door. Wait, what? Wait, what? West Hall. Huh? West Hall. Mandan, right, north, south, east, or west. Alright, West Hall. So we are on... You can't see, there's no... You can't see my mouse. But we're on the top right corner. It can't stop me because I can't read, bruh. Left hallway down to up. Is it? Where are we? Arrow, main gate. But there's... But we walked in on two doors. So are we looking at it from the opposite side? Should we look... Should we flip the map? I don't think we are in this map place yet. Aha, uh -huh, East Hall. Oh shit. Without the factory, we will lose more members. Ever since the fire, this order 
His orders have been increasingly erratic. How many senators? Shh, don't talk like that. Do you want to end up like the Packertons? Everything will work out. Just have faith, sister. The dissensions will soon be upon us. South Hall. Uh. What? So. So where the hell are we? Where the hell are we? I think I'm supposed to place one here, right? Oh! What is that? What is that? What is that? Do This map is not helping. I think we are either on the left side of the map or top side of the map. I know, right? You're looking at a right hall. You... You're looking at a right hall? So you're at the lower right corner? So I'm supposed to walk all the way to the back and... And put the detonator on the left side? Wait, on the right side? I don't know if I'm making sense. Oh, shit. Oh, I have to move stealthily. Hi, James! Bring it back now. Y'all slide to the left. It's on the floor. Yeah, I know. I couldn't pick it up. I couldn't pick it up. Oh, I could. Oh, no, I couldn't. What is this? Am I supposed to place one here? What did the letter even say? Find Neil. What? It really doesn't say if it's left or right. Oh, frick. Inner East Hall. Oh, play C4. Oh, okay. So where the hell are we now? Oh, okay. Hope I'm reading it correct. Actually, you are. I think. So we gotta go in and go to the left side. Huh? Well, as long as I find these things, right? Uh... I think I just gotta find those urn thingies. Okay, that's the door. That's the door. That's the door. I just gotta walk to the far end and then turn left. What? What? Do I not walk into the far end and then turn left? Into the West Hall. Hmm. Oh, there we are. So we have to go inside. He didn't say we have to go inside. Because it looks like the outside. <laughs> Enter the last door. Yeah, now we have to go in. Inner West Hall. This one. Hmm? Hmm? How about that? Okay. Yeah, right there. That one. Oh, fuck, fuck's sake. Oop, I better move from this spot quickly. Oh, fuck, we're trapped. And. Ah, fuck. Ah, fuck. Ah, fuck. Ah, fuck. Ah, fuck. I should have waited. Okay, 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 okay. Let's redo that again. 
So we had to go inside. Let's try from the other side, why don't we? Wait, this time we go left. Oops. Hmm? Or do we have to go in? I don't remember. No, right? Oh, there it is. Hey, I placed it carefully, I will have you know. Now we gotta go inside. Now we gotta go the opposite direction. And now we go inside. He's gonna come this way. Excuse me. Alright, this is the door. How does that make sense? <laughs> okay. Now I keep going, right? What is this? Damn. Okay. Should be here. No? Do I go one in? I don't think I should enter. I already entered. Oh, but I have to. West Hall. I'm lost. I'm lost. Inner West Hall. Should I go into the inner part or no? No, right? Good night, Satori kun! Otsu, thank you! Oh, there it is. Oh, wait, I already put that one. So I do have to go into the inner hall. North Hall. Huh? Uh, okay, then I go left. Oh shit. Maybe we wait for him to go left first, so when he comes right, we uh, we just juke. And then we have to go plant the other one. For fuck's sake. Yeah, well, you gotta go. Woo, clutch. Am I still in the inner? North Hall. Now I make a circle, right? Inner West Hall. Hey, where do I go in from? Did you pl you haven't planned? I did, I did, I did. Uh, that one will bound will. Uh, do I go in from the east hall? That one will be bound to fall. Um, no matter what. East hall. Yeah. Enter chamber. No. Oh, there it is. That's all of them. Now what? 
<laughs> now what? Now I make a circle? I get up from the stairs? Is that how I get out? <laughs> C4 regalia out of it. Go save Neil. Go to the most laugh check the cages. Those are cages? I thought they were stairs. <laughs> Those are cages to you? I thought there were stairs. Okay. Uh, how do I get out? Dungeon. That's the dungeon, right? Enter chamber. We should go to dungeon, right? I thought the thing in the at the bottom were like I think it's dungeon. I thought the things were at the bottom were stairs. I was like, oh okay. Ash? Oh god. Neil, are you okay? I've had better days. How the heck did you get in here? I tell you later. Right now I gotta get out of here. What about Maple and Todd? Have you seen them? Maple's in the next cell over, and Todd is here. I saw him when he when they I saw him when they dragged us here. They have taught in a different room. I'm not sure where though. They knocked me on the head pretty hard. Ash, I think something big is going down real soon. Something bad. Okay, did you see where they put the keys? I'll get you out when we can grab Maple and Todd. One of the guards had the keys, but it's too dangerous. Even if you somehow get it, you and I aren't going to be able to handle Maple and Todd. They're too far gone. We can do it. I know we can. I think it's time for plan B. Neil, no. Save yourself, Ash. Someone has to leave through this. I'm not leaving you guys down here. I can't lose any more friends. I don't think we have any other option. You there! <laughs> Crap. Wait, I know that voice. Who are you? Travis! You need to leave. If they catch you here, it won't end well. Travis, you bastard! You look horrible, dude. What happened to you? Don't act like you give a shit about me. Just get out of here. Come on, man. You can help us and Maple and Todd. Let's all get out of here together. Trust me when I say it's beyond impossible. Ah! I forgot about this dude. He is the helper. I know there's something good in you, Travis. Sal saw it too. He stood up for you when no one else would. You know he did. Do this for him. Sal is dead, and you will be too if you stay here any longer. Damn it, why won't you help us? I'm trying to. He's right, Ash used to go. But it's okay. I've made up my peace with it. I'll finally be with my Todd again. Ah! I shoot them so hard. <laughs> What a beautiful relationship. Travis pretty much had to drag me out of there. I didn't even want to go, even though I knew they were right. I know we plan to blow the temple up, but even if we fail, even if we fail, but I couldn't do it. I couldn't bring myself to press that button knowing that our friends are down there. If you're out there somewhere, please sell. I need your help, please. You can't be gone. Ooh, something's gonna glow. So how much do you want to make her bag? Oh, sweet lord. <laughs> Travis, I've never seen this guy in my life. Travis is the bully. Episode 5. It's happening again. The flashes. What am I? You are unbound. Now it's episode 5. <laughs> you know what, guys? Maybe should we call it? <laughs> should we do a season finale <laughs> should we do a season finale is Sal gonna respond there are five episodes <sighs> might as well you're sleepy the suspense is too intense I'm so curious <laughs> I want to know but I can't put you guys through this even if I'm tired even if I'm not tired I'm sure you guys are we've been at this for five hours <clears throat> you should sleep. You have a stream tomorrow morning. That is true. How long is episode 5? Let me check. I think it's about an hour. Each episode is about an hour. An hour to two. Let me see. Sally face episode 5 length. Yeah, someone the really like a uh, both of the YouTubers play for an hour, an hour and a half. Fuck. I don't know if I could do that, man. 
Will we end at 3 a.m. if we continue? Yeah, I think we will. And I have a stream. I don't want to cancel the stream tomorrow. <laughs> this episode is like two hours. I know. I know. You know what? Some progress uses auto saving. Okay, let's go to main menu. Episodes. Episode 5. We are 8% in. Oh my god. Heck, let's talk for a bit. I know you're probably sick and tired of my voice by now. <laughs> You've heard it every single day. <laughs> you're like, good god, this woman talks so much. Yum, the chat going yum. You know, I actually have the best um, thumbnail for the last episode. Like, I did make a thumbnail for one more episode for this, just in case. Like, I made it when I had free time. So, yeah. Oh, boy. <laughs> Aren't you guys tired of me? <laughs> no. Can never get sick and tired of Adoree's voice. Oh, yeah. Thank you for being here. Thank you. Thank you for being here. My goodness gracious. Five hours and a half. I think like we are definitely inching much closer to like to getting like um to getting monetization on YouTube because I need four thousand watch hours. We are like two thousand in maybe two thousand something. I, I I can't forget. I can't remember. Five hours and a half. Truly amazing. Ah, Gerardi, boo! You've been here this whole time. Has been a blast. This game, I okay. People are like, it's good, it's good. I didn't expect it to be so freaking unhinged. It's just wild all the way. It's just such a wild ride, and I'm so curious. I want to know what is going on. <laughs> Tell me <laughs> before I rip your your freaking face off, and you have to wear a mask too. <laughs> Too good, yeah, a wild ride. Oh my gosh, it is decent for what it is. And it's not crazy expensive too. The game was not crazy expensive. Even I got it on sale, are you kidding me? Oh, so worth it. Watch VODs too. Yeah, watching VODs help too, people. Yes, it, yes, it does. Public watch hours, basically. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you, Asu is right though. 24 hour stream, let's go now! I have I have to stream on Twitch tomorrow um, afternoon. I think I'm gonna push the stream. It's supposed to be at 1 p.m. I think. 1 or 2 p.m. I, I... Man, I'm gonna need more sleep. <laughs> I might start at 2 p.m. And then I'll stream until 5 or something. I, we have to complete the game. We have to complete Resident Evil tomorrow. Yeah, because I have to move to Billy Billy soon. So, yeah. I... Yeah, I'm at, I'm at. So in 12 hours, enough time to sleep? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I push it back, then I will have enough time to sleep. Maybe after lunch, so I can grab some lunch with my family. Then we can like, yeah, we can gather on Twitch. Okay, okay, deal, deal. Try to watch you however I can. Thank you so much. Thank you. Not to me. Thank you. Yeah, I want to start Billy Billy in December. Um. I don't even know how to live stream there. I don't even know where the stream key is. <laughs> but yeah, oh my goodness. I I really wanna um, finish Resident Evil. And then we can move we can move to YouTube for the DLC, Resident Evil Village DLC, the one with Rose when she's all grown up. Yes, I said that she's all grown up. The DLC, yeah, I wanna play that on YouTube, so I wanna noom through Resident Evil Village. <laughs> yeah, we've been streaming for 5 hours and almost 30 minutes. It's 5 hours 25 minutes. Yeah, that one, that one. I even bought it. I bought the freaking gold edition. Like, I got her some drip and all that jazz. Yeah, Rose is so hot, not gonna lie, respectfully. <laughs> respectfully, of course, of course. Depending on how old she is, um, she might not even be hot. Right, 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 right. <laughs> yeah, I wanna play that. I can't wait. So. Tomorrow we have to have to finish Resident Evil Village. Um, we only have Heisenberg left and also Mother Miranda, and then we'll be done. Yeah. Drip rolls, hell yeah! She got the wolf, what's it called? Wolf jacket honors. I don't remember what the outfit is called. Wolf, wolf upgrade or something. Yeah. Out of these hotter. <laughs> Sorry, Rose lovers. Yeah. 
<laughs> I'm really excited. Yeah, 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 yeah. But thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I can't thank you enough. Today is such a long stream, very, very long. And um, uh, <laughs> I want to take attendance, but I feel so bad. <laughs> I feel so bad. <laughs> All right, shall we take attendance? I mean, okay, how about this? Um, Let's take a quick attendance and then I'll take a screenshot. I'll, 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 Okay, let's take a screenshot and take, take attendance. Okay, 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 okay. If you're still here... If you're still here... <laughs> if you're still here... Say... Resident Evil Finale! Or RE8 Final Finale. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna screenshot... So that I'll screenshot on my... Big monitor, so it's H quality, HD. Three, two, one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I screenshot it. Long, long, long stream today. <laughs> Alright, let's see who's still here. Say gold diggers. No, Asu! We have we, we have Asu, we have Geronimo, we have Mercenary BDU, we have Ariel, we have Darius, we have Miku, we have Karumi Star, we have Jung Chao, we have Shrimp, we have Takitagun. We have Zet, we have Kurowa, we have Ami, we have Demong, we have Rogue, Ranger, Roger! <laughs> we have Geronimo, we have Peter Dadumbe! We have Amara Elena! We have Ami, we have Wanyi, we have Chaotic! We have Kurowa, we have Zed, we have 12 Ma Mashley! We have Jungcha, we have Kilaf Andrew! Who else? Otsu, you did a great job, have a good rest! Thank you, Takitakun! Jungcha, I'm here, yes! Oh my god. <sighs> my back. <laughs> my back. But I'm gonna keep streaming a lot this week because this um this weekend I will not be streaming. My cousin will be coming over, so I'm gonna take a break from streaming. But I might do a gorilla stream. If she sleeps early, I'll just do a gorilla stream. So yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pope, thank you for stream. Thank you, Pope. My back is bug back gone. A cousin is a she hell yeah. I haven't seen my cousin in forever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She lives in our hometown, so I can't wait. Mm -mm -mm. Another cute girl. Get with ass. Get with ass. Get with ass. Thanks for the stream. Oh, thank you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. It is free. And don't forget to like the video. It really helps the channel out a lot, a lot, a lot. And don't forget to comment. Um, if you have any interesting stuff to, to you want to tell us about, like any interesting lore and stuff, please tell us in the comments. But no spoilers, okay? Please know that um, we have only stopped at episode 4. We have not progressed into episode 5. So please don't spoil anything about episode 5. Yeah, yeah. So black and light, yeah. And again, I will be streaming on Twitch um, during the day, uh, Monday, aka tomorrow or today, um, depending on where you are. And so, yeah, we're gonna be playing Resident Evil Village finale. And even if you didn't watch the previous episode before, it's fine. Just come and hang out. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like a puzzle shooter thingy with attractive people <laughs> um other than some non-attractive ones but we've passed that <laughs> now it's just attractive people only <laughs> so yeah drop by for wangy 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 moments yeah watching a brain wreck with sally Fa i i will this video get demonetized i don't even know it was quite gory it was quite savage i don't i don't know it was it was wild but um I hope not. <laughs> I hope not. If anything, I might have to private the video <laughs> if YouTube's like, hey, <laughs> then I'll be like, oh, oof. 
Good morning. Hi, Froggy. We were just about to go. Heisenberg is pretty buff. He's attractive. Yeah, yeah. He's just, he's older and attractive. So I think a lot of girls go, open. You know? Yeah. Bookmark this. Yes, thank you. Let me uh, pin this in the chat. I'll be on Twitch. I'll be on Twitch. Tomorrow, so come drop by. In the evening, I may or may not stream Sally Face. The finale. I may or may not. Just um, turn on notifications. So if I'm streaming, you will know. And also follow me on Twitter. Yeah, for sure you'll be able to see it. Thank you, Asu. Blues, hello! Hi, first time coming here, hello! I was just about to go. But thank you so much for dropping by. Hey, yo, I feel so... I feel so... Um... <laughs> I feel so, how to say, like I'm successful now because, you know, these bots only come to people who are successful. <laughs> they only come to people who has like a good amount of viewership. <laughs> or like active chatters. So, yeah. I'm not offended by the bots. Thank you for flattering me. <laughs> Bring Aruri Twitch to a thousand followers? I don't know. Am I at 850? I don't remember. I'll visit more another time. Thank you. I usually don't stream until this late, but <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. Thank you, thank you all so much. I love you very, very much, and stay safe. Mm, mm, mm. I will post um uh tomorrow social post uh in the morning, like early in the morning, maybe five or six in the morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll see. We'll see. Mm, mm. Follow me on Twitter. Oh, it's kind of summer. I'm at 9.10? I'm at 9.10! I'm so close to 1,000! <laughs> but yes, thank you! Thank you for coming! Thank you for accompanying me and helping me out! <laughs> me, Brinch Mom, me need help with puzzle. <laughs> thank you all to all do! <clears throat> I'll see you guys tomorrow for Resident Evil on Twitch! Bye. Good night. Take care. And have a good day. Mm. If it's daytime for you. Bye bye. I do. Ah. Toto. Let's go raid somebody. Let's go raid somebody. <laughs> Lizel is doing a charity stream. <clears throat> do you guys want to go watch a charity stream? Or do you guys... Do you guys gonna go... Um, There's a God of War Ragnarok game too, but... Kind of want to go support my friend's charity stream. It's it's for the... Qianzhur Earthquake? Qianzhur Earthquake? I think it's the Indonesian earthquake that happened recently. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go, let's do the charity. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let's, let's go, let's go. Mm -mm -mm. Guys, even if you can't support the charity like monetarily, um, just retweeting or reposting the link for the stream helps a lot as well. Because if even if you can't, maybe someone else can. So you really help um, the cause out a lot. Indonesian earthquake, yeah. Mama. Emma! Oh my goodness gracious! I was just about to go! Kohi, hello! <laughs> Emma! Oh my gosh. Emma wangi wangi. Emma! <laughs> Trumpet raid! Ayo! Ayo! Mommy, sorry. Mommy, sorry. Mommy, sorry. Hello, raiders. Welcome! <laughs> How was your stream, Emma? I end my stream real fast when I found out you wanted to end your stream. <laughs> I was gonna go raid a, a charity stream. Yeah, but then maybe I should probably check if they're ending <laughs> Wait, let me see if they're ending But but yeah Hello raiders. Welcome to my channel. My name is Auregalia Aruri. You can call me Aruri I'm a wind-up doll VTuber Yeah, that's why I have this key that's perpetually spinning on my head <laughs> It's just spinning. It's spinning yeah, hello, hello. How are you guys? Mm, give me a second. I'm gonna go check if my friend's stream is still on. Whoa, she's been streaming for eight hours. Sheesh. 
Uh, she's currently playing Valorant, but yeah, the charity is still on. Um, yeah, it was for the... It's for the earthquake that happened uh, in Indonesia. Hmm. <laughs> nice to meet you! Nice to meet you! Thank you! Let's do it! Yeah, yeah, yeah! <laughs> Sorry, let me drink some water. Oh boy, my voice has been acting up. <laughs> Emma, Ayo, let's go sleep together. <laughs> uh, <woo? laughs> it's time for us to sleep. Even Kohi like freaking came in like a flood. Kohi like swam in. <laughs> Konami Star, hello, Emma. Thanks for the raid. Let's let's now let's raid someone else. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Still going, yeah. Alright guys, as much as I would love to keep you here <clears throat> Excuse me As much as I would love to keep you here I have a stream uh, tomorrow early in the day um, On Twitch So I have to go now <laughs> I came from Emma's ring I know, I know, I noticed <laughs> Sasuga the, the, the Papa Kohi Yeah I'm learning English for this Oh, hello, Haruno, Haruno Haruka, hello <laughs> Hello, ma'am Perpetual rating, yeah, let's pass the raid on. Thank you again, Emma. I love you. I miss you. Wangi wangi wangi. Alright, guys. Um you, there's no need for a raid message. I, I don't really I don't really care much for that. But um if you do have the time, please say hi to my friend um Ezel or Lizel uh, in her chat. And you know, it'd be nice to ask her about how her stream is going and how her day is going and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, let's go, let's go! I love you guys very, very much! Mwah! Also, nice to meet you, new raiders! And thank you for the new follows! <laughs> Alright, we go, we go! Thank you again for the stream, thank you for coming, thank you! Otsukare sama desu na minna! Suwashi sumida yorobun! Good night! Bye bye!